The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interests at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Can I get a water, please? Thirsty as hell, man. <laughs> get hydrated. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've been here for Let me get a sip of I feel a little, feel a little dry. You feel yourself, feel a nigga? Tart. <laughs> you feel <laughs> yourself, nigga? Yeah, what's, what's up? Wrong? You were stuck at baggage, cl- baggage claim. <laughs> so I know, man. <laughs> Hardest working man in show business. You were stuck at badges Hardest badge Hardest working cl- man in show business. Made my way back. United tried to hate. Couldn't get it done. Couldn't get it done. Atlanta Airport, United Priority. Caca. Priority means urgency. Means priority, nigga. I it was means in- move around. It don't mean talk to your fucking homegirl for 15 minutes while me and Keeb stand there looking doofy in the line. Nobody else in line. Then oh. it's the family up there. Of course, they got nine, 900 bags. They got to come from around the little thing. Take their time, chill. She stopped texting people. Hey, yo, dog, I got to work. <laughs> no I got to get to work. And that shit is built mad, doofy, and wacky. That Stupid. shit is whack. That shit is whack. Hey, Atlanta, knock that whole airport down. Yo, I love, I had a blast out there. You flew in United? Yeah. That well, shit, yo. Well, no, I went Delta on the way. Oh, I, I flew United, United both United ways. United back. Just to go to the pre-check clear line, you got to walk like 20 minutes. Like, yo, my nigga, I might as well stay in the regular line and took my sneakers off. <laughs> I walked halfway around the building to get to the pre-check. Oh, yeah. None of them know where that is. That shit is by crazy, the way. son. Hey, yo, dog, where's the clear pre-check? Oh, yeah, nah, nigga, go that way. Oh, go to go Great that, Event. Go, go to Great Event. Nah, they tell you to go the other way. Nah, this ain't that. You got to go around that to the thing I'm a jig. Yeah, yeah, I smack the shit out of you, man. <laughs> <laughs> no, stop playing with me. Yeah, I got slides on. Wrong airport to wear slides in. <laughs> nigga caught a foot cramp. <laughs> 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 caught a foot cramp halfway through. Walking to T91. <laughs> Where the fuck is T91? <laughs> that shit is far as hell. Is Niggas was in there getting breakfast, chilling. Yeah, I'm shit. walking away. I was what's up, though? Yeah, what's what up? up? What up? What's up? Y'all tried it. I hit the group chat. I'm spilling all the business today. I don't give a fuck. Y'all can quit, walk out, get mad, not call me, not text me. I don't give a fuck today. Which one was this? I'm telling y'all. 13th. The Joe was the 10th or 13th, boy. I'm telling all that shit. Damn, I forgot what the fuck I was about to say. (laughs) You hit the group chat. You hit the group chat. Oh, yeah. I hit the group chat late last night because stupid ass United, as soon as it started drizzling, yo, dog, your 610 is now 850. (laughs) <laughs> nigga, what? <laughs> I got to go. But it's cool. Hit the group chat. Yo, dog, y'all could start. Y'all could start without me or y'all could wait for me. You failed the test. <laughs> you failed, mama. <laughs> what did I? Oh. I was supposed to I kind of want to get it started like immediately. <laughs> oh. Ice pad, yo, I'm with whatever. Like, that's my nigga. Friend for life. <laughs> 15. I, I'd rather start just immediately as soon as we can. What? Okay. Then here come Flip. Flip joined you, two new ass niggas. <laughs> Yo, now, nah, dog, I'm in the area. Let's get it going right this second. I walk in, his fat ass eating blueberry muffins on the side, crumbs out his mouth, boogers in his nose. Here, what's up? I'm here. I'm here. You, th- you, try, you keep trying to take my baby from me. You keep trying to take my baby from me, but I'm, I'm here. <clears throat> I'm here, nigga. I'm here. And I don't do that to you with Flip the Network. I'm here, nigga. Nigga, you be procrastinating, here. nigga. Get your ass Stop to work. Stop trying to take my baby Get from your ass me. To work. You Why two new working? niggas. You and you. Both yeah. of y'all. Stop trying to steal the platform. Narrative <laughs> <laughs> Nancy. Yeah. What else can I start? What's up? <laughs> Yo, fans. Fans. What's up? We happy to see y'all. The last episode, you better act like you're happy to see us. <laughs> End of the summer. Yes, kids see. going to school. It's over. It's Labor over. Day this weekend. It's over. <laughs> Labor Day is this the weekend. The carnival that your girl not going to. She's going to the other one. The big one. <laughs> you corny ass nigga. My, yeah. girl, my girl did say after she heard that, that yeah. I fucked it up and she wanted me to go with her. There we go. You're going to Trinidad. that. Uh, I'm going. Why shouldn't you I'm, say that? Well, she might have said that and not. Oh, you want to listen to this for pod purposes? First of all, I'm, I'm going to keep it real. Well, maybe she's lying the second time around. Who knows? <laughs> I'm going to keep it real. Who knows? You're going to be an all the lip floats, nigga. If you act like you see me, I swear to God, when we, when we land, I'm, I'm violating you, nigga. On camera. Oh, because you're going. I'm going. JR going to record, I'm violent. If you're you gonna try be on to play. Float? If you, he gonna be on the flip, Joe Button. You got makeup on your body. You gonna nah, take nah. your shirt off? <laughs> if you try to play me. You gonna like, you gonna look like Papa <laughs> Shango, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> keep, keep playing. Go out there and be Papa Shango. You, if you beads want. up your ass and all that bullshit. Oh, he do that. Oh, 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 oh,
No, nah, that's his bag on the regular. That's his normal. Nah, oh, that's his shit. Oh, shit. Be, oh, anal bees. Only old niggas know about that. I don't know what anal bees is. You know that's a real one. I think it's Mardi Gras shit. Only other niggas know about that. That's free niggas. Put the fuck bees on your neck. Shitty neck now. Hey, yeah. Yo, smell it. Funky as hell. You go to Trinidad, huh? I ain't starting with no song. We just here. I'm in the drops. Yeah, no, I'm in the drops. I'm in the drops. I had a rough. <laughs> nah, that, that Atlanta airport, that shit was crazy. And she went too? Yeah. That shit was different. And man. Mel went, right? I left mad early mm -hmm. to get to the airport. Mm -hmm. Like domestic, I usually just get there 45 minutes, an hour before. Mm -hmm. Dog, I was there like an hour and a half and still almost missed my plane. That shit is nuts in Atlanta, yo. <laughs> Wait, you, just, you just flew this morning? No, 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 I came yesterday. But domestic, for regular domestic, that shit, you felt like you was going to Russia some fucking way. No it's bueno. It's 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 you have fun? Yeah, it was cool. What's that? Uh, you ice and ash. Mm. You, you picked up some tips. Flipping mail. Some tips? <laughs> yeah. Melon Flip. flip. What kind what of you said last time? Melon Flip. Did I pick up any tips? Yo, y'all here answer? too. <laughs> it, it's funny, huh? Like <laughs> that's what happened. My man it's sat funny, here, huh? Cause I'm gonna watch your bitch ass break your neck to see him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, nigga, look at look this way, you clown ass nigga. <laughs> Keep breaking your neck to look at him. Yeah, that's your man, right? Yeah, that's, that's your my, man. That's my second friend. Second in charge, right? Look, look. It was second like, look, 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 in charge. Like second look, 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 in charge. Yeah, I'm hating today. I don't even know she rock built up here. <laughs> second in charge of what? Of what? what this is a, this is my friend. If yeah. you're asking, Mel did the same thing. Yeah, yeah. A lot of times when I'm up there, y'all niggas don't look. <laughs> like, oh, all right, Flip, you good? Niggas like this, folded, looking straight at Pops. So your main character syndrome has you sitting there. Facts. <laughs> yeah. She thought that was going to hurt. So he yeah. could be second in charge. What episode is this? Quote, unquote. Uh, six, <laughs> nigga, here, yo. 55? Welcome to episode 655. If, if it ain't, fact check it yourself. Yeah. Go to SoundCloud or something. <laughs> I had a long morning. Welcome to episode 655 oh, of the Joe Budden Podcast. I'm your humble, grateful, gracious, and highly favored host, Joe Budden. Big Mel is here. We, didn't, we on you. We oh, on you. God, here we I'm go. on you today. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ish is here. Flip is here. Ice is here. I'm on Ish too today. I'm on both of y'all today. Mm. I'm sorry. It never fell. I'm sorry. Ish got nah. the cool shirt on, so he wanted to sit in the high chair. I see what's going on here. He sat there. No, he, he, he don't, don't, he don't he normally dress like that. What yeah. happened? Why are you dressed like that today? You're dressing young as hell. Really trying to look young now. <laughs> Nigga, we got some airbrush shit. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to bring it back from to 95. <laughs> from the mall. <laughs> Yo, let me get this shit to the mall. Holy Nigga. Shit. Yo, Who man. made that? You want to shout him out? You do look different, like noticeably. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not making a joke. That's them I don't laughing. Know what that means. Bro. Don't don't fire on me because they laugh. I didn't say nothing. Shout them out, man. I don't want no problems. Yeah, you know you was out there getting some ad money. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> nigga was out there. This nigga came here singing. Came don't blame it on the sunshine. Was... You were singing that. Don't blame it on the sunshine today. Uh, yeah, you getting that money. I know. Looking younger, bigger. You look good, man. Yeah, All y'all look good. How was y'all weekend? How was y'all weekend? Good. good. Was cool. Yeah, weekend was good. Mm -hmm. My girl birthday, so it was about oh her. man, how'd yeah, that go? We saw that. I made it through. Are you tired? Photo yes. shoot? Oh, well, let yes. me tell you how it yes. went. I took a picture. Oh, shit. I made it <laughs> Come on, man. I had to get a screenshot. Dad, where's that? Here we go, right here. What y'all did, man? No, took no. a picture of what? I don't know what he's talking about. Took a picture of Ice's caption because I read it oh. in like a girl mm. voice. It was beautiful. Nah, it was my voice. Doing the girl voice. Ice Spice. <laughs> I'm in too good of a mood. You, you, you can't bring sleep. me down. No, no, Ice, no, 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 even no, no, Ice Spice no, no. can't bring me down today. Great night's sleep, baby. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, no. we, we better no. run. <laughs> run. No ice, no ice, please. Run. No, hold on. We got, come on. Read the capture. Ice, it was, it was cute. You want to screenshot it? No, I'm going here, Paige. I know you ain't, man. I had two hearts, I'd still pick you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you was on? You pulled out all the notebook quotes? That nigga got his motherfucking been, John B on? I've been seeing these. Get yourself a Virgo and Prosper memes for years. <laughs> Never before have I believed in any of that stuff. Never. Never. I always laughed at those. I always laughed at those who do. Always. <laughs> but I'm here to say. <laughs> what nigga said? But I'm here to say. Boy, you boy, all right? <laughs> boy, was I wrong? Oh, because this one here. Is nothing short of amazing. Nothing short. Today, we celebrate you. Happy birthday, my love. That's dope, Ice. Happy birthday again, baby. This nigga like Raphael. Deep, <laughs> ain't <laughs> <laughs> he? Brian Michael, who? I can't say nothing because oh, I got man. extra, extra oh. poetic. 
<laughs> on on one of them picks anniversary. <laughs> it was crazy. My mom and friends was in there, yo, you getting married? It sounded it sound like, <laughs> it sound like he like deep in love. Mm. It's important to do that on Instagram for your girl. So what y'all did, man? You had a little party? What'd you do? Nah, no party. We went out to dinner. You shook we, some ass? No. We um because I had my daughter, I couldn't. We 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 pushed that to this weekend. We gonna shake a lot of ass. We had to move things around a little bit, but Yeah, you such a good man. I'd have been started them co parent fights. <laughs> hey, no, nah, I'm not getting up. I'm outside. It's my birthday. <laughs> my baby mom tell me every minute she can. It's the summertime. <laughs> what you gonna do? I'd have been brought that co parent and drama to you. Hey, big dog. <laughs> me and my girl chilling this week, all right? Hold it down. <laughs> it's cool, though. It's cool. I see some all. <laughs> Respect. But fuck Big that. Dog. On my birthday, if you don't come get this kid, <laughs> nigga, my girl's bad. <laughs> Try to give me my kid. That's hate. Yo, that's co parent hate. That's, that's co parent. No, that's we hate. can't talk about it because all of us is in shit. But yeah, anyway. <laughs> now. Yes. I ain't see you in Atlanta. Uh, I was not in Atlanta. Damn. You want to invest this year? <laughs> Yo, yo, you can't say that. Oh. Man. <laughs> you ain't want to invest. Hello, you gotta say something. Yeah, no, I. Um, what happened? Yeah, we I, was all so excited about Invest Fest in Atlanta. I really wanted to go, but I had some prior engagements here that I could ah. not. I couldn't skip. What type of engagements? Mm -hmm. What you planned this? I'm confused. I'm lost. Mm -hmm. Cause. The investment I need has been out for a long time. I know that. I know that. You went last year. You was mad excited this year. Tell your theory, and then I'll tell mine. No, go ahead. You tell your no. theory. No. No, no. you ain't going to ruin my re big reveal. <laughs> I had to do the science from home. I feel like someone may have uh, suggested she stay home. No, absolutely not. No, there was no... There was no suggestion of that part. Mel, we are not pulling teeth today to get... Why didn't you go? So Do my it? original plan was to go um, leave the Friday night because we got off at, we got off at, an, at enough time to be able to get out the last mm -hmm. the last flight. Shout Friday. out to Vince Staples. Friday was a breeze. Friday, <laughs> Friday was epic. He, what Vince a breeze. Vince is amazing. Um, but my girlfriend, one of my closest friends, her mom passed away. So I ended up at a memorial service on Friday evening. Okay, that's fine. And so that just... And I just wanted to kind of take care of that particular girlfriend Got it. for the rest, rest of the rest weekend. Of yeah. Sorry Let's for being it. intense. With no, it's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> what was your theory? Roll I'm, I'm, the still, I'm still going to say it. <laughs> I'm still going to say it. <laughs> Don't think that little trauma <laughs> trick you pulled. I ain't here for that. That's yeah. your little trick. No, go Fuck ahead. Fuck that. Go, oh, go ahead. I, I think that once somebody wasn't going, <laughs> wasn't really an urge, urgency to go. Wait, who isn't going? Who knows? Who knows? Who isn't going? I haven't the slightest idea. You gotta do the science on your own. Ish. <laughs> you what? Good day, sir. But he wasn't going. Uh, but you went. I went. What'd you invest in? Myself. Mm. Tell us all about it. Come now, on, nigga. <laughs> Come on, the third Invest Fest. We all was hyped. We all went. Come on. Do Segment that. A, the A block. Who was the, uh, the performer of the night? It was three days worth of stuff. Who's the pro? Yeah, who the stood nights. out? Who was like, he smoked the shit, boss. I ain't seen nobody that smoked it. I did. I, I mean, I, I went, it was choppy That's when hate. I went. That's hate. I, last year, I kind of paid more attention to it. Um, this year, I, I stayed You're in a celebrity the spot. And That's had a little trouble moving around. No, not really. Anyway, yo, stop with your bullshit. No, I didn't no, listen. Asking the, the, keynotes, the, keynote speakers, the keynote speakers that I wanted to see, uh -huh. they moved their times around. Okay. So initially, like, let's say Ice was a speaker. Ice is going on at 6 o'clock. If I want to see Ice, they moved some of the shit around. So now Ice is going on at 2.30. I might not have been Nigga, here. who did you want to see I that wanted, they moved around? Yo, dog, can I finish talking? Did, whoa, whoa. You, 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 you're using Ice as an example. Who did you want to see that dog, you didn't get to see? As I was saying. Say the name. Yo, bro, stop. Steve Harvey? Who? Which one of them is? So, like Yo, today, said, if anybody snuff anybody, I'm not stopping it. Just don't break no case. <laughs> like I was saying, so some of the people that I... They had a speaker list of 40 people, my nigga. I'm not going to name 16 people I wanted to fucking see. Give me I'm the top two. Example. Puff was supposed to go on at 7. Here we go. Puff mm -hmm. went on at... Tw they was going to put Puff on at 12. They then moved it back to 3. 
You get what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah, that's, that's shit crazy. like that. So if you wanted to go see Puff, you would have went there at five o'clock. You missed Puff. So you missed Puff. Mm-hmm. I wanted to, no, I saw Puff. Oh. I wanted to see Robert Smith. I wanted to see um Steve Harvey. They moved their times around and had them going a little earlier than they was gonna go on. So I missed mm-hmm. them. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So those are the, Robert Smith and Steve Harvey is probably the two that I really wanted to see. Gotcha. But you missed them. Was yeah. there anybody you because you said the times were switched. Was anybody you saw that said, no. oh shit, he killed it. And I didn't expect that mm-hmm. out of him. Oh, okay. oh shit. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. Joe, you are as well. What's right? today? Today's Tuesday. Okay. All right. I'm acting like it's a Friday. But all right. Let me <laughs> taper down a little bit. Nah, man. Turn up, <laughs> no, man. No, taper. It's, it's last, a vacation it's the last pod, man. Last turn up. It's it's last pod. Pod. I went I went to Atlanta for uh I went to Atlanta for my fantasy football draft. We'll get to that, that later. Shout like- out to you fantasy football people out there. That wasn't a yo. It's a bunch of rich niggas in there. That was the actual draft. No, that, yeah, that <laughs> shit looked like I was in New York. Yeah, <laughs> no bullshit. Yo, I got a shout out to Lake. Let me hit the round. That of shit applause looked crazy, crazy because it was. Nah, I saw. Lake was an amazing host. Uh, this was at his home. He opened his home to the to the fellas. I wasn't starting with this, but we'll get to the draft. It, it was beautiful. It was beautiful. But I went out there for that. Got out there Sunday. Uh, Sunday, what happened? I didn't do any invest fest anything. Oh yeah, Sunday. Yes, I did. I went to I went to, I went to uh, see Robert and uh, Steve Harvey okay. speak. I did, How and I it? looked through all twenty thousand of those uh, invest fest festival goers for itch. Mm-hmm. I had security <laughs> walk me up and down every aisle. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Wealthiest black man in in the country up ish? there up there talking uh. this house shit. I just know that ish is in there somewhere, and mm-hmm. I just spoke to him, soaking up game like. Yeah, he, come, yeah, come, he, come yeah, on, yeah, man. Yeah, come on. Come on, man. He ain't gonna procrastinate with this. No. Nah, he ain't gonna do that. One. Not this one. Nah. But I did not see him in there. <laughs> and then I was forced to sit down. Mm-mm. So I sat down. Um, I sat down right directly in front of a screen, so I had no problem seeing. I wasn't turning my neck to look at the stage. Uh, and it was a speaker somewhere over there, so I didn't have any trouble hearing. But I could see how the acoustics in that room would be a problem if you had a bad seat. Yeah, it was mm-hmm. awful. Mm-hmm. Oh, really? It's so, it's so big. The room is big as hell. Okay. 20,000 people in almost like a gymnasium. Uh, I'm, so I'm not trying to dumb it down, but I'm just giving you the it's visual. Echo, echoey. It was kind of echoey. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they, and I understand that that shit costs, but somebody got to pay for it. Yeah. Uh, but I had a blast. I was in there. I, I caught about an hour of that speech. Then I dipped to the back where... Was supposed to be like a private area, and unbeknownst to me, it was mad fucking business owners running around back there trying to talk to me and stopping me. And oh shit, nigga, move! I don't <laughs> care about t- what you're talking about. <laughs> and that's why I don't. That's why I'm staying that's my hot ass in the I, house. That, that is why I had to. I had to go. My anxiety starts flaring up like goosebumps and shit. I, I get those goosebumps every time. I can imagine bad. there's a lot of. Um, Covert sales pitches happening. Covert. At all times. Every step. Every, or maybe o- it's, overt. It's, it's overt, yeah, it's like overt. a motherfucker. Yeah, every little step I took, it was a new nigga popping up. Yeah. Mm. Hey, man, got this magazine and it's starting right here based out of such and such. And my family's from Arkansas. Like, that sounds like Can a you lie. move, nigga? <laughs> like, but you can't say that. So yeah, I just stand there with the dead face. And then some of them trick you. Joe, man, huge fan of everybody on the pod. Then they want to give you the pod breakdown. Where's Danny? I think it's such a, such a, like, dog. I have to go. I don't. <laughs> I work with these people. I'm not here to talk about none of this shit that you're talking about. So I got out of there. That was great. Went to the hotel bar in the Four Seasons. Talked some shit to the people that were sitting there. Went okay. upstairs. Was sleep by seven. <laughs> sleep by seven o'clock. Okay. Woke up the next day. I did Ray Daniels podcast. Shout out to Ray and uh, all the Ray. good people over there. That was that was amazing. Uh, then I went to the draft and. A lot of focus on on the draft. Y'all know I wasn't there last year. I was in yeah. Mykonos. Team was horrible, thanks to Ice's cousin Ray. <laughs> but I'm, I'm giving I'm giving grace to Ray because them lights be bright. I do understand how in that scene with those people talking and screaming, it's a pressurized environment. And then you take uh, dude from Denver, the running back. Yeah, Javante Williams Javante. In, the, in the second round. <laughs> but so we had a good good draft. Uh, we got an A plus. Highest uh, draft grade. All right, that's what's up. I mean, that means nothing. If you're asking me and Keep, and I don't feel like it's that type of team because I don't know none of these niggas. Who'd you get first pick? That's all I care about, really. Who would pick the draft? B. John Robinson. Okay. Yeah, what, what pick you had again? Nine. B. John Robinson, the rookie from Atlanta. He's People are big on him. I don't know that I would pick him in the first round, but 
Well, he wouldn't, he wouldn't have been there no on, on the swing back. Uh, second pick was St. Brown from Detroit. Okay. I like him. I like him. Seems like high, him. but I like him. Seems high to me, too. No, that's where he's going. Yeah, but if you think about it, somebody like how many people be twelve come back? Twelve, mm-hmm. 12 is rough. Yeah, yeah. rougher. Yeah, twelve that's is true. rougher. But it was a good draft. Nah, the, I'd have to pull the vibe, it out. The vibe looked better than the draft. Word. He had cigar rollers there, ice sculptures, hostesses, bartenders, cute ones too. <laughs> like I always judge niggas. They usually try to provide the the feng shui, and it'd be some ugly girl. But they was all right. That shit looked. It was fun. Big screens amazing. everywhere. Just just a real good time. Shout out to everybody in the league. But we're not here to talk about that. Uh, I don't I don't know what's newsy. All I know is Rob O'Neill calls some nigga a nigga. Oh, shit. <laughs> that's that's what all I, I, I know. I heard he got uh, an assault charge. He, that's the first story that broke. Mm-hmm. And I said, oh, man, he must have called somebody a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you thought that from the rip? Yeah. Really? I have, a, I just have a theory about people that have seen and been through what he's been through and that type of PS, PTSD and what they do when they get drunk. Mm. Uh, okay. Okay. I don't see where the N-word come into that, but all right, you got it. Oh, okay. How do you think they kill all the people? What you mean? Nigga! <laughs> Yo, that's oh, the Call of Duty chat rooms and shit. <laughs> Yo, that's oh, that. Shit. And what y'all think they were saying over there in Afghanistan? Oh shit! This sounds like disaster over there. Disaster. Yeah. Oh Yo, man, you said, you disaster. Said. You, you know about that? You ever heard about that? Huh? Yeah, I, w- I saw the clip. You watched it? Yeah. I watched the clip. I didn't see the whole shit. Bro. They booed. They booed the ass off the stage. Yeah, booed him. They wouldn't let him finish. Who? Why? What happened? They called me a. He, he said. He said. I said boo. Nigga. Wait, disaster said nigga. He said, yeah. Oh, he said. He's telling the story. You can't say. He was telling a story. He Who? said that's a real sick. You can't say that. <laughs> Oh, oh <laughs> no, 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 he said white. He said he was telling a story. He said the the white people called them a. They do. And when he did that, they booed him. He said, "I said it. At least I said it." Get off the stage, Schmack said. What we doing? <laughs> you're, not, you're not gonna let him go. <laughs> no, boo. <laughs> they stopped. It. I would have done the same thing. Wow. No, I wanted to hear his story. I thought they were wrong. I what's, wanted to what, hear it. What's homeboy's ethnicity? He's some other shit. Yeah, he's from the Middle East. I think East he's Middle Eastern as well. Yeah, so I, I think I think he deserves the right to tell a story. Yeah, he was telling a story. That is tell a story without saying. No, story. that's his story. Yeah. If you a black man in America, you could tell your story and say that we've been called niggas from people from other races. Wait, what did he say? Y'all know I'm bad with geography. Where's nigga from? <laughs> they said somewhere in the Middle East. No, <laughs> that's that's black. <laughs> no, but he was telling a story. So te- but. He's yes. not black. Yes, he they said, are. He said the, yeah. no, wait, hold on. Disaster now. is not black. He's and not this black. is not our A block. <laughs> <laughs> Disaster is black. No. Is he Middle Eastern, though? Yes. yes. That's black, fam. Disa- cool. Go ahead. Disaster <laughs> is not black. Hey, don't try to, don't I don't try know to trick me with, yeah. with pyramid history. <laughs> Anyways, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna geography yeah, black. class. No, he ain't no black. Ways, yeah, good. Go, you Google him. And, I'm about to, but keep yeah. going. We good. Yeah. No, we done with. Because uh, I want, I do want to talk about the battleship. You later. saw it. You saw. No, I didn't. I watched it. Yeah. Good. I want you to tell me about it because you know that talk I had with you last week about battle rap and the state of it. I'd like to speak to you about it on air. Mm-hmm. Um, what y'all want to talk about first? Rest in peace, Bob Barker. Come on. Yeah. Rest in peace, yeah. Bob Barker. The, the legend. The legend of legends. The myth. The god. The sick day king. You acknowledge Facts. You know, you know. Bob Barker? Yeah, yeah. come on. Of course. You're supposed to I'm lead this. I'm 47 years That's old. Your nigga Bob when it comes to some of the, when he had brown when it, hair and shit. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to some of the white greats, you know what I mean? You don't acknowledge them too much. So you're against this. So I just want you to acknowledge Bob Barker properly. He be against white greats? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what part I be on? Yeah, Male I, or female? Yeah. Oh, yeah, like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I acknowledge Not Betty everyone. White. Betty White, you know, she was one of them. But. Betty White, Chelsea Handler, uh, Jenny Buss, <laughs> Jude, whatever her name is. It's Bob cool. Barker. Rest in peace, Rest in peace Bob, Bob, Bob Barker. Barker. Yeah. I, saw somebody, yeah. I saw somebody tweet, Bob got as close to the dollar without going over. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> he was 99. I thought that was fire. That's, 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 that's a good one. That's fire. I thought that was absolutely fire. Legendary Bob. Thank you. Thank you for my grandma. Rest in peace, grandma. 
I mean, if y'all, if you're old enough, you got some idea yeah, about Bar. Yeah, like yeah, like Park said, the Sick Day King, man. man he held us down. Yep. Sick Day King. Yeah, man. Go to Grandma and Grandpa's house on the Sick Day. <laughs> have you some soup? Yeah, he yeah. Did. He did. A little grilled cheese, oh, maybe. Facts. <laughs> Those were the times. And they, had yeah. some, they had some monsters showing them grills. Facts. <laughs> You know me. <laughs> <laughs> you know me. The Broyo <laughs> collection. Shorty coming out there with a skirt. Oh, nigga. Bob had to, <laughs> Bob, Bob was smooth with it, too. He'd go over there and flirt with him with the little what? pencil Bob was light. a flirt. Yeah. yeah. What? Bob was a flirt. Bob yeah, wasn't playing man. with him. What? For sure. Rest in peace, Bob. Definitely. A legend. What a life. Indeed. What a life. You, you did it. You bro. did it. Yeah. You did it big. That ain't nothing. 99, 99 years old, man. bro. Making millions just to... Mm. <laughs> yeah, well, like, yo, that's a dream job. Look how Mel dressed when she leave the beanbag at home. What beanbag? Like You're beautiful. <laughs> when you take that potato sack off. <laughs> What's the about? beanbag? You know what? what? She she be I really thought that you would like my fucking potato sack, okay? It kind of reminded me of some shit you've worn. Well, I wear potato sacks. <laughs> I'm not a sex symbol. <laughs> okay, sometimes now, sex symbols want to chill the you, fuck out. Do you denounce your sex symbolism? No, never. Never. But I am multifaceted. So you was in Brooklyn. I was in Brooklyn. You didn't say nothing about that this weekend. Uh, you just said something about a passing. But you didn't say nothing about Brooklyn uh, and the party. How do you even know and, that, nigga? Like, huh? It was all over my story. It was all over my story. Because she put all the dark skin girls on a story. Oh, my God. I saw her. She went out of her way. Wow. Every, every day, every minute. He was like, my girls. Yeah, like, look. These are my wow. bestest friends. Look. Okay. And then they were standing there looking like they just met her. Oh, yeah. No, nah, she's cool. <laughs> hey, <laughs> y'all. Hey, What's your name again, shit. sis? <laughs> oh, shit. Where this going? Your story? <laughs> <laughs> What's your at name? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck out of here, man. Shut up. Do not jump on this bandwagon. Okay? Okay. Oh, okay. Yes. So what was you? Uh, Spike Lee had a block party in Fort Green Park in Brooklyn. Mm. Mm. Yeah, and it was, uh, funny enough, it was MJ versus uh, Prince. DJs. Well, I mean, it's not nobody. No, no the fans won. The fans won. Yeah. The fans won. They yeah. say there was like 30,000 people out there. I'm oh, like, shit. Y'all think R. Kelly could beat uh, Michael Jackson? <clears throat> In the verses? No. It's, it'll be great, though. Flip says yes. Ice? Yeah. No. Parks? No. <laughs> I think yes, two problems. <laughs> I ain't going to hold you. I think yes. It's 20 songs. I think R. Kelly could, I think he'd been his mic pause. Think so? I hate, mm. to, I hate to ever agree with Lil Boosie. I never want to agree with Lil Boosie. So I'm going with Michael Jackson just because Bo- Lil Boosie. <laughs> <laughs> But Boosie said, um, I think R. Kelly will get Mark a long. He'll give him a long. He's going to be a good fight. I'll give you that. It won't be a walk in the park at all. It's definitely not a walk in the park. It's definitely not a walk in the park. And if you fuck around and get annoyed and really want to. Really want to what? Really wanna really wanna what? I'm talking about R. Kelly. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. You piss him off. Like, all right, now. Hey, you play. If you turn Thriller up one more decimal, I'm going to step in the name of love your ass to the parking lot, nigga. I believe I can fly. Oh, you get the choir out singing and shit, too. Oh, you watch it. Hold on, Mike. Watch it. Nah, I really want to see Mike. Mike, Rest in peace, Mike. And R. Kelly, really. He's not dead. The R. Kelly we knew was dead. I mean. Anyway, I saw somebody say, um, because I think it was like half of R. Kelly's royalties had got seized to be given to his victims. Mm-hmm. And my man was like, see? So me playing this music is actually helping. I said that on here and I got <laughs> looked at sideways. <laughs> <laughs> like, mm. if, if the money going to the victims, you helping them. Step, step side to side. We might have found a way. Black to... people, I do think that song needs to come back. Y'all, we wrong. Yeah, that a couple, step, a couple of them. Step in the name of love, right? Mm-hmm. But that one for sure. Like, come on, black people. Happy, pe- happy, happy people. Happy people too. It's it's you you gotta bring happy people. Happy back. people have to come. They go together. Yeah, yeah. You got to cook happy. out. I'm gonna speak for the whites and say that we're gonna want the remix to ignition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. The white club. <laughs> now usually I don't do this, but uh <laughs> We need that. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. yeah. That shit go up in the white club. I don't like that the new kids did that. The niggas in jail, oh, you know, he's gone. It's over for him. Yeah. Well, we he, he, he paying his price. Hey yo, YouTube deleted all his videos. For real? YouTube, man, I researched it. YouTube said that they deleted his videos because he was charged with something egregious. It's exactly what the statement said. So I wondered if that carries over with everybody. That's what I'm saying. They deleted the whole of everything. No, but I'm not mad at them doing that. They Why? Have, they have to do that. 
But apply that across the board, then. Though. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Yeah. If like, you're doing that, then do that shoes. to everybody. That'd be my only thing. They said the music is fine, but the videos. No, he deleted all his, his Vivo and everything. There is people. If another musician comes out with and is guilty of those crimes, uh, now you moving think forward, happen? I think it will happen. But why not delete? They're the not going to retroactively go back and I don't I just don't see it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work for the two person department that's running that. Mm. But it was easy to de- delete. And it's, and it is a big it is a big deal when anytime you got to go in the system and recode and algorithm whatever they got to do to make sure your face is never seen again it's work <laughs> probably it is but the music should be easier to take off listen i bought tp uh tp2 about 19 times when you when are you gonna take it from me i'll go in an old coat and find that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, that shit in the cd yeah. in a drawer yeah, somewhere yeah, sure in one of them boxes if in, I walk the in the garage yo bullshit i'm gonna find that motherfucker <laughs> uh so what's up miguel is yeah Miguel is bugging. <laughs> yeah. Can y'all fill me in, please? Yo, is that true? The yeah, hook's in he, his back? There's videos. There's video. He was yeah. with the hooks on. I don't so, know. So the singer Miguel, you know the singer Miguel. I know Miguel, yes. Allegedly, he... Um, no, not allegedly. No, 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 allegedly. no, it's a thousand no, we saw percent. This. It's video. Yeah, it's video. It happened. Put hook things in his back. So Pierced. He, piercings so that he could be elevated in his show and hang from the hooks while he By performs. his skin. Now, why is that so off-putting... Uh, in, the, in the name of art. I mean, it's art. I'm sure he looked at it like art. Yeah, sure, it's art, but it's gross looking. You look, it looked painful. Yeah. 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 He looked like he was in pain. Much less scary, my nigga. Like, you your skin is pulling, you could fall. In America, you draw the line with art. But, but listen, it was... Uh, they put a harness I on. I was going to say, just put yeah, the fucking put, harness yeah. on. I, I saw him, this might have been on YouTube or wherever I saw this, but some lady was just... Exhibited her, was she used herself as an exhibit for like forty eight hours straight, where she just stood somewhere with a whole table of items and weapons and whatever, and she wanted the audience to do whatever they wanted to do to her in that time span. She was trying to show something. She was trying to show that humans are nuts if you mm-hmm. let them. If you breathe. let them, absolutely. So, but that was the art, and it was overboard. And humans did start doing nasty yeah, was, shit there while, 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 while she Oh, for was, real? Yeah, she was bleeding and all types of shit in what I saw. But point was proven. So what Damn. I'm saying to y'all is... You got a it, sick it, algorithm, it's, nigga. It's what some, the fuck are you yo, doing? Yo, there's a dude... So, so, you know, everybody's like cap um, on these live streams making money different ways with tips and like the girl Pinky Doll. And all. There's a dude that was in a closet and he's letting you... Oh, R. Kelly. It's <laughs> <laughs> 25 <laughs> times And depending on what you donate Shit can happen to him Like if you 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 pay $25 They'll throw a flashbang in there while he's in the closet This amount, this happens This Like he getting fucked up in his closet With a camera on non-stop And just people are paying to have shit happen to him Like yeah, we got no. this obsession with that kind of weird shit Human yeah. beings, Joe Because they, because you just you hitting a button to make it happen. Mm-hmm. It's like it's, it almost comes off as not real to mm-hmm. you. Mm-hmm. Like if you, I think if people were physically there and had to do something to a person, they wouldn't do it like but that. But Joe just saying the opposite. He they said was the lady was in the lady. thing and they was, mm, it, they was weapons and shit. Just random people walking up grabbing. It didn't shit start that way. It started out very mild, and then by hour twenty seven or halfway through, it just started getting a little bloody with the weapons, and they was doing sexual shit and what. Uh, yes, but humans listen. Humans is different. I guess. Yeah, humans are disgusting. Yeah, we're, disgusting we're monsters. Mm. Miguel, what song does he have that that's appropriate to do that to? Was that a new slap? It looked like it's some new music that he's debuting. And was it like uh, he was like in a silver room? I don't know. Yeah, I don't it looked it. like yeah, a it's just some weirdo. Shit looked like a me. performance at the box. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I don't know. Hey. Yeah. What? Pitch? We can't yeah. say box. That way is heavy box. on you. Well, wait, well, hold on. Huh? Do you have you guys? You guys have never been to the box? No. It's an actual place. Huh. Yes. I've been, but you've been. I have yeah. been to the box. So have I. <laughs> so, <laughs> so have I. What type of freaky shit goes on at the box? I've, I've been to the box too. I want to hear what you saw when you were at the box. What in the Lizzo goes wanna, on at the at the box? I want to know what you were doing at the box. I the was, box is bananas and coochies. It's a private. It's like a secret society. You got to just... It's, I don't think it's there anymore. The no, box. it's still there. The she, box is still there? She knows. She knows. She was Explain, there explain the box, bro. <laughs> yeah. 
Anyway, the box is some private shit in the city where they on stage. It's like sexual Hamilton, but it's like really explicit. That's a really good way of putting it. It's sexual That's Hamilton. That's a really good way of putting it. It's, it's for the freaks. Fucking- well, I haven't seen intercourse happening there. It's theater. It's ah. yeah, it's performance art. Got it. You know, so really So they sing and jerk off. But they was listen, you playing, but go. Okay. Go. Yeah. And they don't mind you getting forget it. Hey, yo, you freak, <laughs> you freaky Jason, yo. Yeah, so yeah, so. Yo, you you you, you nasty. freaky Jason, yo. Why y'all say that to me and that Melissa Ford? <laughs> <laughs> she hung out with Quincy Jones, nigga. She be trying to, <laughs> <laughs> she hung out the nigga and went to the bookshelf. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but then she come over here and try to act like none of that shit ever happened. That's a fact. I come in here That's and be true. my real you true do. self. Y'all you know do. I'm some freaky ass I wild, see Dr. Wild Jekyll and Mrs. Hyde. She, she come in here and try to be, oh, I'm an off ass. Y'all be the people. You was like, yo, the box hit around. She's like, no, 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 it's, it's still there. Yeah. Word. <laughs> it's, it's still you there. freaky Jason. It did look like some box shit, though. If the box is still there, we out. We out. We out. We need to go. Say less. I had some of my best nights at the box. Interesting. I had some good nights in the box, too. You can't even help yourself, right? Like, really? You just gonna grow into this old man? Is this the old man you this gonna This is be? a performative show. Facts. It's a, it's yeah. a, it's a, it's a Wednesday pod. Y'all niggas want to be funny, be funny. That's all. Yo, yo you, you stepping up in year three. And I know. Yo, you really gonna hang on this thing. Stop smacking me, yo. Hey. Or oh, hey. fat ass hands, yo. Uh, Miguel, I just want to hear some music, dog. He put, he's been putting out singles, though. I want to hear some good I wanna, music. I want to... I want to hear body of work from Miguel. Ah, that, that's what I got. Mm. I feel you. I've been playing a lot of old Miguel recently. He's got I ain't playing under new Miguel. He's been putting out records. Park just said. I'm not so mad at uh, that Wild and the whatever record he put out a few weeks ago. I'm not so mad at that. The other shit wasn't bad. It's just got to be like it's it's like a got to be a time for that. Old Miguel like coffee anytime. Mm. Adorn mm-hmm. anytime. Mm-hmm. How many drinks? Anytime. Anything from kaleidoscope. Yeah. Anytime. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So let's talk about BS high, yo. Please. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's, let's talk about BS high. Thank you. All this other thank shit. Thank you. Thank you. I just have to start by saying thank I you. I ain't really get a chance yeah. to see the whole shit. Oh, <laughs> yeah. uh, you missed it the was, fuck out. Nah, I'm gonna watch it. I take it none of y'all saw my story where I was in, in Instagram where I posted BS high and said this is the funniest thing I've ever seen. Oh no. Nah. I saw I didn't, it. I didn't know what you're talking about though. Yeah. Same. I said it started with BS High on Max. <laughs> I didn't know, yeah, what, I didn't know what BS High was, none of that. But BS he, High <laughs> might be the funniest sports doc I've ever Dog. seen. It is by far the funniest sports Easily. doc that has ever been produced. Easily. Easily. This dude's a star. And it was true. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. It's a documentary. And the gentleman, what's the guy's name? Ro- Ro- Roy, Roy something. Roy is Johnson? great. Roy is made. Oh, yeah, it was Johnson. Roy Johnson. Roy Johnson is made for television. Absolutely. And what made this even better is I remember that game. Me too. Yeah, me too. We talked about it, I mm-hmm. think. I remembered it. I remembered it. We talked about it here. Yeah, I think so. Okay. So BS High on Max, spoiler alert, but it don't even matter. It really don't matter. Watch it, it anyway. Yeah. yeah. The dude, <laughs> it wasn't a school. <laughs> it was no school. <laughs> He kind of made up a school, and this was the second school, but it wasn't. Was it was an extension. Say, it was the, yeah. yeah, it was the same school. He just that wasn't a school. Mm-hmm. He just changed the name and got an athletic program going. Mm-hmm. He took PPP loans out on wait, all the kids. Wait, hold up, Joe. No, 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 no. You skipping? You skipping? He got kids that was twenty and twenty one <laughs> years old <laughs> to play as high school kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's his staff. They was 20 and 21 coming to the high school game. The reporter said, he overheard them saying, yo, now we got to go out and beat up on some 17 and 18 year olds. And he was like, why would they be saying that? Something, something, something wrong. <laughs> something, 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 something wrong. Something wrong. Bro, he did what the uh, Russian girl did. Same shit. What Russian girl? Uh, Anna. Anna. Uh, he did the same shit, yo. Different industry, same shit. Oh, yeah. These niggas is geniuses. I thought that was brilliant. That is some genius. It is absolutely brilliant. There's no law. He had architectural plans showing the, <laughs> the fucking a new stadium with an overground football field with a basketball. Fly shit, Corey. Fly shit. Mm-hmm. Like, money went into this. It has to be a school, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. Or, or does it? It's a school in my brain. But you're right. He didn't break no law. He didn't break no nah, law. No, no law. So where do y'all fall on it? Was it a scam or not? Definitely a scam. 
A thousand percent scam. It's a scam, but it wasn't it's illegal. It's a legal scam. It wasn't illegal. It wasn't illegal. He didn't break no law. I have Yo, to imagine that putting the law for illegal. Oh, a legal. A legal. Yeah. Then how is it a scam if it's legal? Because it's fraud. I think that it's. I it sounds familiar. Imagine. I had to imagine at some point, yo. I had to imagine at some point. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. you better hope that this, these rules are applicable somewhere else. There's no way that putting PPP loans in someone else's name is legal. Like, that has to, at some point, blow That's right. on him. Was he putting yeah. it in their name or he was taking it out on the kids? Because when you got PPP money, the PPP money was predicated on he how many. He was putting it in their names, bro. He yeah. convinced the kids to start LLCs. Oh, well. But I'm glad you know that you are our PPP expert. I'm not. But I'm just saying, your PPP, I will be. Your Start PPP, them up again. Your PPP allocation is based on your staff. Mm -hmm. So if he had the kids down as employees, so if he had ten of them, mm -hmm. you yeah, you, you eligible for one amount of money. But if you got twenty more, you know, mm -hmm. so fifty, you eligible for a PPP loan based on fifty people. But as wasn't he getting I'm the a, kids to start LLCs so that they could take out the PPP loans to pay him to pay yeah, him to pay yeah. him exactly? How much money did he yeah. make? <laughs> we don't really know. Well, they well, never said. They never yeah. said. Yeah. I like never said because he started getting help. And the funniest and shit was when he found out they could stay at these hotel rooms and pay net ninety. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Yo, the way he addressed it though, yes. he looked at the camp. Wait, wait. So you telling me we oh. can get these hotel rooms and I don't got to pay them right he now? Said, he said, "Oh yeah." They yeah. mentioned that he was doing um, tuition for a school that doesn't exist. For it was either twelve or sixteen thousand a kid, and there's fifty <laughs> kids. I'm, I'm not the greatest at math, but it sounds like close to a million dollars. <laughs> 50 kids at $1,200. $12,000. It's six, 600 grand. Mm. 600 grand. So, and he did this t at least two years, right? He, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but yo, he started getting help from bigger institutions. Real coaches was hitting him, I'm like watching, asking him for yeah, assistance. I'm all watching that. the whole yeah. time saying, yo, this looks expensive. It looks expensive. I have to imagine just the, the pads and the jerseys and shit would be but then fairly they, they expensive. They started getting donations and they started getting mad charitable shit from other people, they said. This way it went wrong. But, I mean, to him, this was the win. He, to him, being on ESPN was a win. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's the other interesting part. He said they but played like 11 games. They went and yeah. got the dude who puts together the toughest high school yeah, schedules. schedules. The dude that puts together the schedules for like the really good nationally televised the prep schools. That was yeah. the mistake. He could have went and just got with the lesser known high schools and played. But once you hit ESPN and don't, <laughs> you see what they were doing on ESPN? I wonder if they get paid for that. Yo, the commentators Ooh, eventually cool. started, hey, dog. Hey, what's up with this? This don't look, something's off. Fam, they did a substitution and, and a backup quarterback. They didn't even have his name. It was like, oh, we, and he we, wasn't we, a quarterback. We, we no. don't, we don't have number ten on our. On he our wasn't a quarterback. He was doing some bullshit back there. <laughs> yeah, he was a mess. They didn't score a point. I'm, I'm pretty sure most four could have thrown a better football than they were good. They were good. Probably true. But they was interviewing the players. They was interviewing the ops. Like they was in. They had. No, everybody. they got everybody. They had yeah. everybody. So no, they they were not. Good. The school had to be getting some money from uh, what school? It was in school. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. But from the networks, the kids they only sending oh. a check. Yo, the kids said. The kids said we didn't have no plays. <laughs> <laughs> he said one of the kids told him we got this from Madden. Yes, oh, shit. <laughs> they had the Madden plays. We'll go play for Madden, bro. I'm going to watch this shit again. <laughs> yeah, me too. No, this shit was good. This hey, yo, was... look. Uh, go uh, down long. <laughs> <laughs> Ten steps and make it right. <laughs> I got you on the button, my nigga. So he wasn't arrested at anything. No, no. Oh, people sued him for um, fraud because he defrauded <laughs> a bunch of hotels and all types of shit. It's like a whole second show within this show. It's just listening to him talk. Oh yeah, and like they even asked him about the lawsuits. How many lawsuits you got? He was like, well, well how many did you read? <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, you tell me first. I what you know? I ain't about to put no number I, out there. Listen, I ain't snitching this on myself. Smart. I ain't snitching no, he's on smart. myself. He is so, he's so entertaining. He, 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 he has a career. I will watch the Hulu version of this. Absolutely. The Netflix That's version of this. As long as he involved, this, I watch them all. The Amazon 30 30. version of this. All what? of them. 30 for 30 will get to it. Dog, he sat down and the first thing he said was, yo, I took a body language class so I don't look like a con artist. So should I hold my hands like this? Yeah, I like that. Like this? Like he came I like him showing with... that. <laughs> yeah. No, the ill part though, not, I mean, we spoiling the hell out yeah, of who it. Who gives a fuck? Yeah. Sorry guys. It's still going to be funny. When he, when yeah, he, it's when, funny. It's, when you got to watch it. He saw the one kid 
um, the video that the kid gave a testimony, whatever, and got mad and walked off. And didn't realize his mic was still on. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> what he said? Yo, he went the fuck. <laughs> All the shit I did for this fuck ass kid, man. <laughs> fuck him. This is bullshit. Yo, <laughs> bruh. It made me while his man's just sitting there like. He was trying to like. But what do you say to, to somebody who says I'm the most honest liar that exists? Like he said that in the confession. Told him straight up. I was like, "What'd you say that, dog? Um, you got me. I'm you good. got me. I'm, I'm rock. Get your you. shit off. I'm a rock. He was like, "I'm not gonna lie to you on something that you could prove." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 that fire. That yes, sir. Yes, no I was like, "Yo, he smoked that go, part. Yo, you did. Go do your research, nigga, because I'm not giving you nothing." He was like, "If you could prove it, I'm, I'm gonna tell you the truth." But, but then what do you say? I, and I, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to serious this out. That's fire. I don't think you can serious this out. You but, see the, the meals he was feeding them? I don't remember. <laughs> you, uh, the pan of, what was it? It was some oatmeal. Bro, they was just mixing shit. Oh, they was like, yo, we don't know this porridge, oatmeal. Yes. What is this that they eating? It the was, kid, I remember. The kids started stealing food themselves. They go into the supermarket. <laughs> oh, he took the kids to the supermarket to steal <laughs> to food. Steal. Oh, no, he ran the scam. Remember the scam at the, uh, he was like, yo, I'll call a, the supermarket, order, fit, order 25 rotisserie chickens. And then, right when they get ready to close, say, I don't want them. <laughs> so now I know they about to put them so out. So now they're going to put them down on discount. For $2. And now we're going to pick them up for $2. <laughs> like, yo, he's had every scam laid out, dog. It's Bro. great. Flip, you don't have to be in the sports for this to Listen, be Listen, no, no, this is going to be great. I'm Bro, this is going to be great. Yo. All jokes aside. This is like if you was like, this is, <laughs> yeah. this thing is nuts. I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it. You will love it. So entertaining, yeah. though. I'm going to watch it. I got you. It's some brain shit that going on a nigga that even think like that. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Nice. For you to really break, yo, 25 chickens. I know they're going to discount them. To think of, yo. I'm going to start a school. <laughs> What? Where people what pay tuition and that? there's no bricks and mortar there. Get, yo, Roy, if you out there listening, yo, uh, have your people reach out to Facts. me. I'd love to produce your podcast. <laughs> You're anything. <laughs> I know his phone got to be on fire. Oh, I'm sure. He tore that up. Yeah, he did. What do y'all say about the underprivileged kids portion of it, though? Like, because some of those kids really got on there and was like, yo, uh, it was foul, but he was helping me. Like, I didn't have no, nowhere to go. I ain't had no parents. I ain't. Like, some of them was really that. Mm. And some of them at the end ended up like... Hey, playing. Playing mm -hmm. for, for different schools and stuff. Like, you know, some of them, it did help them. And some of y'all ended up not playing on good schools. I love at the end of the doc when they put the words on the screen. Mm -hmm. I love to read. They started with the most successful one. Such and such went on to play Division One at such and such school. Mm -hmm. Then another one went on to play. Hey, he went on to play mm -hmm. Division Two. Better than one more went to like Juco or something and then came to failures. That's all, man. This shit is like, funny yo. all the way at the end. Such and such is working at the deli down the street, but he still has dreams and hopes of playing football still. <laughs> such and such is a was fucking a flunky mechanic, they but he still has yo. dreams and hopes of playing while he football wait, still. While he waits for his next football yeah. opportunity. <laughs> hey, ain't no more hey, football, ain't opportunities, no more football opportunities coming, <laughs> Aki. Huh, Rage? Hey, Ak. You can, pack, you can pack that one up. Nigga 24 years old. <laughs> nah, that shit was better than Remember the Titans. Yes, God. That shit was amazing. This guy. Nah, high school sports, that shit is a big business. Hey, yo, hold on. Did you that really? But it said it's called oh. BS High. <laughs> Wait, yeah. Bullshit BS high. high, yo. That's hilarious. What'd you say? Did you see? Well, I saw a clip going around of a football coach, high school football coach in Atlanta that got arrested. Oh, yeah, I saw it too. For punching a kid in the stomach. Nah, let him out of jail. Let him out of jail. What happened? As a parent, come on home. High school coach, uh, kid ran to the sidelines. He's talking to him, just punched punch that nigga in the stomach. stomach. On the news. punch. Tell him, tell him, you be looking at it. It's film. Come on out of jail, big dog. I be, I pick, I bail you out. All I was there, my parent, the, the parents. Yeah, yeah, that was, was crazy. crazy. Yo, could you imagine that? No. I don't but know. People where, were defending him. Where though. was that at? In Atlanta. I don't know the school. I'm gonna get the defend. It. Listen, how do you defend it, yeah. bro? It's coaches that did. The way real, worse. Uh, yeah, way worse. Not you don't do that in high school. You don't do that to us. But that's what yes, people do, bro. Niggas yeah, was doing do. that shit to us in little league. See, people were saying you was in little league. What? I was nice, nigga. I don't play, play baseball. No, I play every sport when I'm small, but I play baseball, basketball, <laughs> yo, football when yo, I'm small. Yo, yo, yo you ignorant. Yo. I didn't even man. say nothing. I played baseball, basketball, and football when I was little. Your but little league coach did, was doing what? shit like that ish. That them little league coaches that smacked the shit out you all that. Yeah. Did it teach you to toughen uh, up? See, see why we need they that. They was father, <laughs> this they why was we father need figures. <laughs> this um, is why we need that. Ass. It's Atlanta. Oh, Some Benjamin, people Benjamin, Benjamin Mays. Mays. Yeah, Benjamin Mays High School. 
All right, you speak. I don't understand. I that promise you. Yeah, some people father. That. Some fathers ain't mine. Okay, well, the way that I dad, <laughs> the way that I'm I, on. I parent, you cannot punch my either one of my kids in the stomach without me paying a puff daddy trip to UCLA. Makes mm -hmm. sense. Mm -hmm. I'm not mad. I ain't mad at it. I'm some just pa telling you that's some, not some parents, some parents don't mind. Yeah. I'll go to jail over that. Bro, Bobby Knight was the, as big as you could get. See, and, I, and, I, and, and he was is, wow. That's where my hypocrisy comes in. Though. On TV. Yeah. College is totally different for me. <laughs> Why? One, the kid is older. Mm -hmm. Two, Damn at, near at, at that level, at that level of sport, the, the, that coach went there, the staff went there, the parents vetted him, the parent kind of know what you want. Bobby Knight been fucking kids up since the 60s. <laughs> like, if you send your kid to Indiana, I'm assuming, or Dar Cheney, Temple, like, there's a few places if you send your kid, I'm assuming that you want your kid to get that type of discipline. discipline. Mm -hmm. In college, and I'm not with them punching him in the stomach, but yeah, throw a chair. I like all that, that wild shit, but all that punch, a, a physical injury, you are injured your, your player that you need. No, I'm not knocking. I'm just telling you that that's not uncommon. I'm not saying I agree too, with it or whatever the case may be. I would have beat be. the dog shit out of him. He deserved to get his ass whipped. I'm not saying I agree with it. I'm just saying it's not that uncommon. Would you beat well, the dog shit out of Roy shame. Johnson as a parent? Well, my parent wouldn't have. I mean, my son, my kids wouldn't have been there. Yeah. You need to beat the shit out yourself if yeah. you allow your if kids your to kid go to a school that ain't a school. If all that's going on, then yeah. That's, you gotta yeah, hold but yourself accountable. You you can kind of understand a lot of them parents like the kid's dream was over. Here he comes with one last. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's a dream that I, I can see how some of them parents bought into that shit. Now, like the one lady said, she started questioning once the kid sent her pictures of yo, this what we eating. Hold up, what's going? Wait, what? Something ain't right now. Like if they sitting there promising you, yo, we'll get your kid the exposure. Uh, we know for whatever reason, grades. And they were taking the kids that nobody else wanted. Mm -hmm. So that right there, you kind of pray so on the easy targets. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can see how somebody could go with that. Gotcha. Some of the kids were, he said they were homeless. Um, exactly. A lot of them didn't have father figures in their lives. Like mm. They prayed yeah. on the week. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So if you're a parent in that situation, you damn near like, yo, take them. Yo, this is give my kid a chance? Take them. Like, he'll, he'll oh, he, he can get to some D1 schools take or whatever em. going through this program? Please take them. You're doing me the favor. Help. That's crazy. I just want to make sure y'all heard me out there. I'm fucking him up. <laughs> come on, fuck come him on. Up. I know it's a pod and we got no not Roy. Oh, the oven. No, no, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Punch him right. in the stomach. That's it. Yeah. No, that that's that one there. He, deserve, his ass he deserved it. I ain't mad at it. What else happened that I missed? The uh, NYPD um, put together a sting operation to shut down the prostitution ring over there on the Pennsylvania Avenue. The one you was just talking about? The yeah, the one I was just talking about. I was just over there, uh, you know, you exploring. You yeah, hot, I went on man. YouTube. <laughs> I, ain't, I, ain't do, I ain't do it. You know what I'm saying? They, they put a whole shit together. You was over there trying to shoot persons? They, they bagged Shauna? <laughs> <laughs> they bagged Shauna? Nah. Uh, you took the black and white camera down there to see what them hoes is up to? <laughs> <laughs> That's hate. That's hate. Yeah. I support you, nigga. I, I saw be, you. I be your first like on some of them shit. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, damn, man. Damn. They had a whole operation. The police said that they had to get the pimp. They had to put the... Because some of the girls, oh, this is not funny. They'd be 15 years old. They'd be young. Oh, but sure. they also stated that a lot, a lot of us think that when women go out there on the track, they say that they think that we think that they're doing it because they just woke up one day and doing it. And they wanted to do it, but it's not the case. It's they say, a thousand percent that. not the case. I, so, I don't think that at all. That? I, I did. definitely never thought that. Not all of them, but I thought... I didn't think pimps were still ill like that. You thought that some girls Nigga, were, listen. just woke up and said, hey, I want to be a hoe. I'm going to go yeah. just rock Yo, out I on the stroll. I know some girls that told me personally, but I didn't see a pimp and I was around them for a while, that told me personally, nigga, I got this tuition to pay. I'm going outside. I know about five of them. Whether it was a strip club, whether it was on a track, I know them. To pay their tuition, oh, to pay their shit. Saying. That's what I'm saying. So not saying that... I see you saying. Not saying that it's impossible, but when I was younger, that's what we heard. Like, the pimps got them, the pimps got the hoes, but I thought it was different these days. No disrespect, I thought you women got... <laughs> know what I'm saying? My fault. Oh, you saying you didn't I know... I see what he's saying. I see what he's saying We're now. not talking about the same level of prostitute. Yeah. Yeah, mark that. <laughs> That's not the crazy. <laughs> no, you saying that you didn't know that people still was being 
um, led by pimps. You thought that the girls that was out here selling their body were selling yeah. it on their own accord. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, gotcha, yes, gotcha, yes, gotcha, yes, gotcha, yes, gotcha, yes, gotcha. yes, yes, yes. You that. need to graduate in your No, no, Joe, when, when, we, when, I was, when I was... Intellect? When I, no, that's, no that's, not the intellect, just see? the girl. Yo, why, you, yo, why you always saying that, nigga? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get at you. Stop, stop playing with me. Stop saying that. Stop questioning my intellect, nigga. I didn't say... All right, because you go on these... Prostitution intellect. I didn't say flips intellect. And I was saying... You might, your, you're down, you're down. Your, your prostitution... You up. Your prostitution class needs to... All I'm saying is that when I was younger, I did see it. I saw the pimps... At the end of the block with a girl, I saw that, but I didn't. I haven't seen it as of late. As a grown man, when I'm driving around, I'm seeing I'm seeing them girls hopping their own shit, Infinities, Hondas, <laughs> Benzes, mm -hmm. Kenny Red somewhere. Yeah, calling the shots. Nigga. Yeah, but that's what they, that's what they cell said. phone generation now. So the, oper the, op the operation was to capture the pimps. So they put something together. They they were uh, surveillance in the scene. They got the pimps out of there. Then they talked to the girls. But some of the girls were running. Some of the girls are. They said that some of the girls are mentally. Fucked up. I'm loyal. Sure. I'm loyal. Yeah. I'm loyal they're too to loyal to them. They're, they're attached to the pimps. Stockholm, Stockholm. syndrome. Stockholm. Mm -hmm. yes. Got it. But that's hate because I was just over there and that shit was lit. I told you it was a bag. I got the, I got the recorder, nigga. You can't Yeah, that's why I wanted to call you on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to get in the car. <laughs> so fool, you speak yo. to my man. <laughs> yo, you stupid. He, he, he a paw pimp. <laughs> Yo, we'll get you on the pod. Yo, we need you. To, yo, you yo. just did that. Yo. We need you on the back. Yo. We need you in the back. Oh man, is this like an inside joke. Like I missed it. What happened? That's hate. That's hate. That's hate. That's hate. We're laughing at my man expertise and getting to women's head and talking to them. That's it. That's how the pimps get them. Okay. Oh, they definitely do that. They don't step on our shit. I'm they, sorry. They good. <laughs> you got cramps already, nigga. Joe know how? <laughs> oh, of course you do. That 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 thumb, no, nigga. No, Joe know. Yeah. That thumb. That stupid nah. ass thumb. He put in the action. He put that thumb on him first. <laughs> then that boy get the rat cast. But isn't it uh, back? Is that rat cast? Because we, we could question that too. We could question the thumb tactics too. If you want to be technical. The other thing, Atlanta is different as a forty plus year old. How so? I want. <laughs> Go ahead. I want to hear what you got to say first because I agree with him. But go ahead. It is. It is. Like, you know, if you've never been to Miami, then when Wayne said live on Sunday, you just had a, a vision of what Miami represented or what the vibe was, even if you've never been there. Atlanta and Atlanta's music scene, if you've never been, you would get the interpretation that it's just Liddy, Copper Cove, it's just... But as a 40-plus-year-old, if you are not directly going to these places, it's like chill. Super chill. It's chill. Super chill, super opportunities. Chill, good weather. Tons of opportunities yeah, out just, there. Like, niggas is getting to it. All of the... And I guess I was out there when it was... But I... I when I, it was that... It just maybe it's not that anymore, or maybe I just I don't know. Maybe you just not you mixy. Just not, nah, you're not, listen, you're like, just not, you're not over chasing there. that. You're not it's, looking for that. Cause Cause it's not, still there. That's true. Yeah, yeah. It is definitely still there. Atlanta is still a oh, no, the, for all the mix that. was out there. But if you're not looking for but the mix, then you start saying, to see oh shit, it's so age, much other yeah. shit. Yeah, Atlanta now that you're just seeing things differently. Out there. Mm -hmm. But that wouldn't just apply to Atlanta though. Like that's everywhere. Yeah, that would apply. That would apply to Miami. That would apply to DC. That would apply to these places that. If they was mixy, or if you was going there looking for the mix, it's one it's one look. But once you go there and you're not really looking for the mix, and you see all other business that, yeah. opportunities that's yeah. out there, Atlanta got a that's lot outside of, of the mix. Oh, DC, yeah. you gonna bump in the mix walking to CBS? But you, you don't walk. You, you gonna walk? You gonna you, you gonna Atlanta, let me shut up, Atlanta. Big dog. <laughs> DC is all right still. That's nah, my favorite Atlanta, thing to do with DC. Walk, is, walk, is, is walk to CBS. Atlanta, Atlanta too. Yeah. Yo, you go there. Oh, I'm not walking to Atlanta. I'm not walking. Nah, that Publix. Nigga. You like that Publix. Uh, you too. You do. <laughs> you too. Why you always put me down with you? <laughs> the same reason you do it to me, nigga. But you don't like when I do it to you. I know. So then why would you do it to me? I'm giving you a taste of your own medicine so you can see how I feel you. Tit for tat at 47. Yep. <laughs> Shit, you should be yep. ashamed of yourself. I'm rubber, you glue. <laughs> I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Fuck out of here. What else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, speaking of your uh, prostitution segment. Uh, <laughs> so... What? You had a prostitution. I segment. was going somewhere. <laughs> Look, I set up though. You want to see where you going? <laughs> off, of, off of your prostitution segment, gotta clap it up. 
Uh, DeAndre Aiden is off the streets. Oh, man. <laughs> These niggas is dumber and dumber. My, my girl cat got to him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I ain't mad. I'm looking for the translation. I ain't mad. Hey, my girl, my girl, cat. If you know, if you know, cat, you know, cat. Salute the cat. Cat got to him. So DeAndre, DeAndre Aiden, center for the Phoenix Suns, who got a big contract. Just signed a halfway big, big, big contract. Okay. Uh, he can't. He went out. They went public mm -hmm. with Cat Leia from New York, or wherever you from. We know him from New York, and. People started instantly comparing that to the Zion, to the Zion shit. situation, okay. which if I'm Cat, I get if I'm offended by that because Cat is not Mariah. Mariah is a nut. So now Cat is putting out pictures from like 2019. Well, if, Ish, if you know Cat to be that way, then please. I didn't say anything. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I mistook you. You mean the nigga that was doing somebody doing the ladies hair? She had a video. Yeah, that's her. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. The nigga that was. I don't. The that's what the, that's what the video went up. It was her, and he was like, he was doing her doing hair, something to her hair in the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a few videos. It's a few out, videos. It's a few videos. The, out but that now. was the he one. Was doing more that, than hair. Yeah. yeah okay. That that's what he's talking. So she was somebody. About. In but video. back to my, we've had this convo here before. But these women are <laughs> winning. That's a win. That's a dub. That's, that's a dub. That's a dub. Yeah. Wesley Snipes. It's a dub. Sniper queens. They 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 all coming up. It's Niggas got three hundred million dollar contracts. They they taking the 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 young baddie that they don't know nothing about, but the rest of us do. Mm -hmm. mm. It's a girl that they've been and the young at baddie. They was in high school. Yeah, they like they like all that. It's a girl that been you know. Hey, I mean? yo, let me tell you something. These women, and they'll go public, be seen. Yeah, because they happy that they want to show it off. They want to be in seen. In our day, we hid them hoes. These, <laughs> no, but no, no. That, that's the thing. In our day, let's just say I, I don't want to disrespect nobody, but who was up? Halle Berry or um, Nia Long or so we wouldn't necessarily know they passed or if they had a past mm -hmm. we would have been sporting them so them girls might have had a past that we wouldn't have known nothing about but we would definitely be outside in Shore Hills Mall holding Halle Berry hand Halle Berry no I'm talking about China from Sue. I know <laughs> shout to China that's my nigga China. Love, China. love China that's love you China <laughs> yeah <laughs> These women are good at playing Listen, possum, if fellas. That's what DeAndre Aiden want to do, but he. And you know what though? But I'm on the girl side in this. I'm not mad at them. I'm on the girl I'm side. I ain't mad at them. I could be mad at them. Fuck. Well, you could be mad at them. Why? Tell why? me why. Well, I I couldn't. But why I, you I can't? How could a person be mad. be mad at them? Come on, y'all gonna make me be this guy? No, they're no, just, seriously. They're, right, on, they're deserving of love and opportunity too. I agree with y'all, but there is the working wo woman that is up every day, like really dedicating her life to trying to find love or conducting herself in a manner to which she thinks she'll be able to bag one of these $300 million niggas. Well, that's and then everyone, go ahead, go ahead. I agree with y'all. No, I'm just, I'm just y'all asked me, so I'm answering. And now you see fucking Kat and Mariah and Bernice and the list goes on and on. I don't put Bernice in that category with them. What? That was Mariah, don't do that. I was just talking about the, the beautiful women. Okay, categorize them properly, though, because you, you have a voice. You was around yeah, that. You're not going to sniff that Bernice pussy. Stop, man. It's over. Sniff who? You're not going to sniff that Bernice pussy. You ain't got a cape like this. I can't. Who was that? Who? <laughs> I didn't hear you. I said <laughs> Bernice. You, 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 you're not oh. going to sniff that pussy. It's chill. I Don't worry about it. You ain't got a cape. Salute, <laughs> salute, salute. Shout out to Bernice. That's my, I love you. That's my people. You know I love her, too. I'm yeah. never putting her in the class of them. You're absolutely I'm just right. trying to help you. You're yeah, absolutely get, right. Get your you're mind right. right. You saw her in the. In the, in the but place. the beautiful girls. Got gotcha. you. We'll do that. The beautiful girls back in the NBA, niggas. Y'all don't see how the working class girl get mad at them. All right, don't worry about it. Hey, listen. They the same as the nice guy finished last nigga then. A lot of, a lot of these yeah. women. Mm. The same thing. Hey, yo, and I'm going to tell you when they get them. Uh, look, when the girl, I, hold on. When the girls go out there nice and get the ball. Cool, when the girl go out there uh, and get, a lot, of, a lot of the ladies, when they go out there and get a ball player, they just had an incident where they had to lay low for a while. So they play possum and they pop out like, wow. So you think these bitches, you think these ladies, excuse my language, are down, but they not. They not. A lot of them that got players. Actually. They last incident that they had was disgusting. Whether it was an Instagram shit, whether it was OnlyFans shit get leaked, taking an ass in the club, whatever shit, we got them. They disappear and they pop back out. Why Dude. would y'all be asking me why those girls would be mad at those girls? <laughs> well, not, 
that's, that's it. Yo, what a beautiful, hey, beautiful what? skyline <laughs> back there. Hey, yo, Mel was getting them before. Huh. Mel didn't have to do that, right, Mel? <laughs> Mel jumped from one shit to another shit, nigga. <laughs> Hello. She jumped. Really? When the nigga fucked up, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about it. She did. She didn't have to. She didn't have to. <sighs> Some of these girls, man, they get smacked in the face with a lot of money. And, you know, they, they get tired. They watch shit. They go on Instagram. <laughs> they watch their homegirls fuck somebody else. And they, they, they put together a plan, man. It's an organization, man. How do y'all feel about Night's Guy's Finish Glass? In closing. Because <laughs> I can see where we could go. <laughs> no, we're going to talk about some music or something. How do y'all feel about that? Anybody? <laughs> nice Guy Finishing Last. Yo, dog, we're on a podcast with 17 people. Y'all gonna stop using me as a <laughs> table. <laughs> Nigga, give y'all opinion. Yo, don't disagree. Oh, you know how I feel. Give y'all you, opinion. You know how I feel already. Shit out of luck. They gonna look at me, ish. No, nigga, you got mouth? Nice guy, niggas. How do you feel, though? Nice guy, niggas, is trash. <laughs> the nice guy, nigga, is a hater. Losers. You said what? The nice guy, nigga, is a hater. And that a, says that. He's mm, hating. No. And you shooting. Yes, yeah. absolutely. I, I went That's why you're agree. saying that. And you trash. The nice guys are haters? The nice guy that says nice guys finish last is a hater. Oh, they said the nice guys are haters. No, no, okay. Okay. The, the nice, guy nice guy who has to say that, that shit. Way, I don't agree it? with that. Okay. Why not? That's why, why we went to you first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you nigga, you it's good for them niggas. You give too much in the beginning. Niggas it's a game. Yeah, you niggas do be suckers. I ain't gonna you lie. give too much in the beginning. <laughs> yeah. You go in there, you go in there with your heart in your sleeve. I could do this for you. I could do that for you. Y'all was... nice guys only win when I took after, a month after I took Shorty to the cleaners. I must have really put her through a darker time. Yeah, talk about it. That's when she got to find the exact Spin cycle, opposite. Nigga. That's when all that she, she got to tell her girlfriend, "Oh, you don't even care. She's nothing like that." Yeah. Oh my like, oh, God, yeah, you come out of nowhere so trying different. to be a friend, nigga. Thank us. You nice niggas, thank us. Thank him. Hey, you nice niggas get a three-week run. <laughs> this is not Antoine. <laughs> Antoine. Stating this shit that, that is these misogynistic that niggas is are saying. Yo, it's not me. I'm How good. Not misogyn How's it misogynistic? Yo, you said, nice yo, the niggas? nice niggas is mutts. You only lucky to get the girl after I've tormented and tortured her. You need to thank me. Is that not fact? <laughs> it is that a fact. fact. Yeah. You about to sit up here and pander, but it's fine. Go I, ahead. That's what I do. Yo. Nigga, you down? So yes, <laughs> uh, I'm not down with that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think good. I don't think nice guys finish last or the term nice guys. And I'll take it a step further in the words shit. of Ice. And they don't like nice niggas. And they don't they like y'all. That, that is true. They don't. That is true. They, they don't. give too much. A lot of women don't like them. But they give too much at such an early stage nice in the guy. situation. Uh, the, here's the problem. But she's quiet. No, but because I'm just I'm taking it all in, and hey. yeah, and you're right, and you're right, and blah blah blah. Thank you. Who, you know, and who's I'm right? Say the no, no, say, say audio. Who's right? You're accurate. You, Joseph. All right. You're accurate. You we, when you put motherfuckers through a spin cycle, then we want the actual. The, a lot of times then we want the opposite. opposite. Day. You said yeah. two niggas was right, and who else was and right? And you said that as well. Yes, you said that as well. So what's my name? Flip. Thank you. Don't get that nigga credit. Stop kissing up to that nigga. Fuck him. I'm your friend. And what? don't chop that make it your ringtone either, creep ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> so you try, you put me in the creep category, nigga? No. Yo, I don't think you're a creep. I'm more, I don't think you're a creep. I think the concept of nice is... You a nice guy, actually. You are a nice guy. You a nice guy, suck ass nigga. On the low. I'm not nice for real. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I'm nice on the low. You got to know me to be nice. Let's, let's get right. over that. Yeah, man. I think the concept of nice is where the problem lies. You know what I mean? When people yeah. address themselves as, I'm the nice guy, and you guys are saying, no, you're really like the sucker. You're really like, you know, you you your intentions are not altruistic. You know what I'm saying? Wait, and what is that? Oh, sorry. Melissa Ford. No, that's fine. Okay. No, no, I'll get that shit off. Because yeah, no, she helped what me learn. What does it mean? Yeah. What does it mean? I don't know. I never even heard if that you're trying, word. If you're, if you're trying to win over the affections of a woman by tr altruistic. Oh, shit. Yes. Altruistic. Yes. How are you going to get a DeAndre Aiden talking like this? <laughs> don't, I don't necessarily want that, want that drama. I really don't. It, I don't. I don't. I don't. Hey, E, why you keep putting the camera on me? Are <laughs> oh, you, oh, you learning? You hey, learning the lights? E, why the fuck you keep you putting the camera the lights, on me, <laughs> You learning the lights, nigga? Stop putting the camera on me, yo. Altruistic. <laughs> Showing a disinterest and self, selfless concern for the well-being of others. Unselfish. Yes. Wow. Mm hmm Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Why you don't want that drama? Huh? Why you don't want that drama? She wants what? Who don't want drama? 
Melissa. How old is this? Melissa Savannah Melissa, well, Ford. Stop it. How old is this gentleman we're talking about? He's like three hundred million dollars old. How old is he? <laughs> exactly. How old is he? He's probably like 26, 27. 25. 25. 25. 25. 25 years old. Three hundred M's and plays in the league. No, I do not have. I don't have the wherewithal so, and the fucking stamina not, for do, that do you level not have of confidence, fucking drama. Do you not have confidence in yourself that you could make him be faithful? No. Provide him and, and cover every corner and make him a, only love a, a 25 year old with 300 M's in the fucking league. You better not be faithful. Salute. What the oh, fuck? Oh, oh shit. Are you stupid? No. That, that's, no. No, oh, not shit. you. But like, just like seriously, that is the point in time in which you should be just going ham. No, that's facts. Absolutely. And anybody that thinks that you're going to be faithful, that's. That's that's on you. Stop looking at my man. Son. That's on you. Know, you. He not giving you eye contact. <laughs> Stop trying to reel niggas in. He not. Stop. Stop. He's I mean, not. I wish he was sitting there. Exactly. He was I, right. He was right. I'm so happy. I'm he was right. He was right. He was my little neck. <laughs> Mel. Mel. If I what? Oh. All right, so let's, all right. If I, if I, Mel, if I me, take you. If, at, I if, take you at face value. I believe you. I if believe me, if saying. me right now is dating twenty five year old with three hundred M's. She wants the GM now. Hold on. Get I have off, I have no expectations of him being faithful to me whatsoever. Mm, big Mel. We'll be well, sorry. We'll be. Oh shit. Said, sorry to the mic. <laughs> we'll basically come up with some kind of like arrangement that works for me. What works for the both of us? But it fidelity does not play a role. What? Oh. Yep, take the tone out. <laughs> we, oh, yeah. we it gonna, was, we it was, gonna, was a little spicy. Yeah, it was spicy, She just got hit in the face with a mic, nigga. It no was spicy. It wasn't my mic. I don't got nothing to do with that. I ain't hit up with the mic. Yeah, only you your were brain. Saying, yo. if, if so, so let me ask you a question. Take the age away okay. and make him 45 mm -hmm. with 300 M's. Mm -hmm. Do you think fidelity is more um, feasible? <laughs> I mean, you can say no. Why do you put a price on face? No, because no, because no, because the, the, uh, there is no real. There's no way around this because it's really up to the individual. But individualism. But out of here, the, the <laughs> generally speaking, that class of man usually does not think that he needs to be faithful. So broke niggas are only only broke niggas are faithful. Yes. No, a lot of times so, they're not even fucking faithful. That's why that's whole, that whole fucking so that, nice guy shit is she's bullshit. Right. She's, she's right. She's but, right, she's but right about she, that. But she started off like, yo, when you're 25 with what's the whole? M's. What's that saying? You're only as faithful as your options? True. But when you, you got $300 million, I mean, you, 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 you have so endless faithful, fucking options. Who are the faithful ones? Is it categorized as nice it, guy it, niggas that y'all just said No, suckers. not even. I, I it's, but they're not even faithful. Two questions for you. Yeah. Do What percentage of men do you believe are able to be faithful. That's not age, not money, just period. And secondly, well, you're gonna answer first or you want me to go? Go ahead, keep going. Secondly, is, is, that, is that a trade you're willing to make? I will trade all of you dudes who are all of these M's up for fidelity from a man. Mm. Good question. Now we, we I, <laughs> let's sit up. Yeah, we let's bumped, get, let's in, get, we bumped, yeah. we bumped let, into let, a good topic. This is quality right here. What do I think is the percentage of men who are faithful? I think that men use the excuse of I'm a man and biologically I'm not supposed to be faithful. Monogamy doesn't isn't biologically a function for men. I think that that's bullshit. I think that oh, I hear Corey already. <laughs> Corey doesn't have a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I think that that's bullshit and I think it's a cop out. You know. Um, Truly. Um, I, I can't put a percentage on it because, like, I know both. I know men who feel like they don't have to be faithful because they pay all the bills, they make all the money. Well, then those it's, men go, don't go in the percentage I'm asking not, you for. Yeah. And if you know both, you should be able to make the percentage. But then I, yeah, but then I also know... 40% of men? I would say, like, at, what, the, the, the guys that I know, I would say that mm, about 40% are... are are faithful. And the second question? And the second question, would I circumvent fidelity for stability? stability. For stability. Well, not, maybe well, not, not, stability. Even, not even stability. Because the nigga because, cheating could be providing yes, stability. Yeah, true. But no, but that's Well, that's, financial that's stability. Financial. Yeah. Uh, 300 M's? Oh, but it could be, it could be besides, maybe he's a great guy to be around. and Financial convenience. No. 
Maybe he's great in all the ways, but sometimes wants to cheat a little bit. Well, then I don't really. If we've had this conversation, then it's not really cheating. If I'm, if I am, if but I'm what in if the you know. Don't have the conversation because yeah, that's an open relationship. That's a different conversation for a different day. You, he's, you he, know, I think about he's the, pretty smooth. You don't put it in your face, so I, and he just he might. So go I think. Out. So I think about this a lot and how much fidelity used to mean to me when I was, you know, younger and in relationships and mm -hmm. found out how he was cheating and how much it fucking hurt my heart and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And I think that over time. I don't know. It, it, to me, it just... It's not as important. It's not anymore. that important. You know what I'm saying? Like, if all the other factors are there, mm -hmm. and then there's the consideration of not having it in my face, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Then... That's why it's confusing. I would, that, I would like to... That's why it's confusing. That's one of the more honest That's very honest. That, dog, but when you start getting older and you start realizing if a nigga is checking all of these other boxes, this box, no pun intended, is not as important anymore. That's something that society told you to go to your monogamy point. They they go hand in hand. Right. And like I, men say, the monogamy thing is not biological. Monogamy is not biological for men or women. Yeah. It's not. It's something that was taught to us as proper and right. Mm. And now we do it because we do it to be uh, in line with what society is. It's the told social us. contract yes. that we've all signed, yes. you know, yes. quote unquote. And we just we we abide by societal norms and traditions and mm -hmm. rules and that sort of thing. When in actuality a lot of societal, you know, norms and traditions and stuff are an ill fit for, for some of us. Sure. You know what I'm saying? We're we're human beings, we're not a monolith. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, so for me, I just I don't know. To me, it just doesn't seem like that big of a deal when I put in the hierarchy of my needs, that that falls like towards the bottom. I appreciate that. You know, it just for me it does. So that's very different than where we started, which is I I don't want that type of headache. <sighs> True. Because I'm talking about the 25 year old. You know that lifestyle <clears throat> is it? That is a very big ostentatious, like, huge lifestyle, and I just don't... You read the A's. Austin but no, Powers, but you read the A's. Right? <laughs> Austin Powers, right? Austin Powers, right? <laughs> you read the A's. You read the A's. Ostentation actually starts with an O, <laughs> but that's okay. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> that's she did a, the vowels. But that's okay. <laughs> I did get through the vowels, oh, yeah. Man. No, but it's... But I you, did that, and it's like, it's not in my wheelhouse right now. You could be yeah. at home, though. Like, I think that... um. With, with those lifestyles those women and again I'm speaking from an unknown perspective but I know a little bit about little dog they sign up for that you know what you're getting when you go fuck with a nigga that makes 300 million dollars that's traveling every two days it just it you means, know it means a, lot a lot of women in your also think that I could change them no it's not a even, lot of people do that yes. even, if, even if it's delusion to themselves or Hey, yeah, it might have happened to that one but it's not gonna happen to me exactly I, I and it's delusional that. but also what comes with it is Women in your DMs, women threatening you. Like, it's just, it's just a lot of smoke that I don't want. You but know what I'm saying? At any age, though, don't you think? And, it's, and, it's, and, it's and, more, and, it's, it's part it's, and parcel it's, with this. She's hard. It is. I'll so. take the 300 M's and deal with her. I'll deal with that girl. <laughs> okay, girl. <laughs> I'll, I'll write back to all of them DMs. <laughs> <laughs> but, I don't got to work. <laughs> <laughs> I'm secretary of the DMs. And it's cool. We didn't have to deep dive this because yeah. them niggas are not at Afropunk. No, they're definitely not at Afropunk. You went to Afropunk too? I did go to Afropunk because it was in Brooklyn. I fucking may as well. When in Rome. You so know you what I mean? She should just live in Brooklyn. I she wants like. to be no. in Brooklyn. Yeah. No, 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 no. She doesn't no, no. want to be in Brooklyn. No, no, no. no Y'all no. ain't peep it. This, I peeped it. What? I what? We peeped it, right? We had another LA nigga sit on this couch mm. who said he was going to be at Afropunk. Don't don't start that narrative. Yeah, you was I a little, will you fight was a, you, Ice. You was a little too Holy friendly for that. <laughs> what the fuck? You was, I, I ain't like that. You, I, you was a little too friendly. I was not, and, I, then, and then I saw your tweet about the nigga, like you hyping the nigga, like that I, was what she said. Holy that was corny. shit, what I'm hyping it? the fucking pod. No, you hyped the Vince Stable as one. He was one. great. Like, man, he was amazing. Oh, he was like, great. You said about the. Uh, <laughs> nope. He, I respect you. you my sister. He, I wish you'd have been in that bag when I met you. What? He wasn't so friendly then. <laughs> what the fuck? Back in the days, right? Yeah, it wasn't. Oh, one of one. Such a great guy. <laughs> so a pleasure to meet you. The fans seem to have liked Vince's episode. That's uh, amazing. Of course. Yes. Uh, true. So true. No, I, I, re yes. so so I reposted. I, was, I said he was Vince a great guest. I didn't see him. Uh, 
I didn't see him. I was at, he, when he performed, he performed on Saturday and I was at the block party. Okay. So I didn't get there until the, the last act, which was Flying Lotus. Okay. Um, and then the next day, Jack Freeman was performing Shout and then Tiana Jack. Taylor was performing. Okay. So, yeah. Right, right on the heels of our Fidelity conversation. Mm -hmm. Can you believe it about Bill Murray? Shut oh up. my god! <laughs> Not funny, Bill. Yo, yeah, man. I can see why Khalifa would want to be with him, but can you see why she would want to break up with him? Oh my god, you guys! Fuck what? That oh, was a up. phenomenally worded question. What? what? Who knows who broke up with who? They well, the might have just. The report came out that okay. Khalifa did. She broke up with him. That is what the report says. We don't know. He you ran right. out of okay. jokes, but the report <laughs> did say that. He ran out of jokes. So now, can, you please, no can you please speak to it? Because that was a bold ledge that you stood on that day. It was a crock of shit that you stood on. <laughs> but, and, and, what, and. That, that, that funny guys can, like, you know, get in women's drawers? Like, no, 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 They could, you're right. Funny yeah. niggas could get them dropping. Yeah, don't try it. Yeah. But, but that wasn't that, that day. So what was it? That day it was... His pockets. No, you were making it seem like there's... That was the reason. What? That he's funny. That was, was the reason. I was saying he's Bill Murray. He's probably, he's very funny. He's probably charming and whatever. And uh, what's the word? Uh, charismatic Rich? and the whole nine. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm. She why always, are we going to act? Wait, hold on. Why, why do you do that? But why are we acting like Khalees is a pauper? Like, why are we acting like because that? Because she's a pauper. How, do you know this woman's pauper? Where's Khalees money coming from what right is now? The, what Tell is, me where Khalees money is coming from right now. I can't tell Where's you Where's it that. coming from? She signed mad bad contracts. She fighting with Pharrell. He took all that shit. Nas is like, mm. where, yeah. <laughs> yeah where, where's the, where is the money coming from? She has a no. farm. She wrote a book. All right. She, all right. All right. All right. She not to Esco right. to Escobar. Right. Now he just right. not show she, down. She, she, she sell she eggs. Not she's got eggs. Eggs. She, she has a school. She's got, she's got, she's got, she's got, she's got commercials out right now. Like, uh, can, you, can you speak to the breakup and what your, what your thoughts are? Yeah, she just sit here. Oh, it's fine. She got a farm. It's fine, baby. <laughs> she knits in her spare time. She, she might fucking knit. She I don't crochets. know. I'm oh, not going to sit here and act like. Hobbies. I'm not going to sit here and feel like she was trying to fleece fucking Bill Murray. I'm not doing that to Khalees. What do you Khalees. think about the breakup so soon? It, they might have decided, hey, we make better friends. Mm. Mm. You think they went with the, let's be friends? It's not you. It's we should have never crossed yeah. that line. We it's not you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the <laughs> one. I have to find myself. It's not fair to you. So I yeah, want to. Yeah. Maybe distance got in the way. Uh, I bet. Uh, I don't know. I know distance. Yeah, yeah. that happens. Three a lot. inches versus. <laughs> <laughs> that happens a lot with celebrity oh, couples. <laughs> <laughs> that was disgusting. Dude. That was dirty. Some son. distance, all right. That little ass Peter Wheeler. That little old ass idiot, man. What the fuck is you talking about? You hate I mean, that's that's shit off, that's man. That's definitely hate. Yo. I didn't want to say it, but I mean, ED might have been, you know, now a you, situation. Now you agree with that? You were just hyping it up. I'm pretty sure Bill Murray's got him's money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he can make it happen. Oh, man. This is some crazy <laughs> shit. <laughs> man, so. Not Bill. Good old Bill, right? <laughs> That yeah. nigga's is phony. That nigga's flip like this. Y'all. <laughs> Mel and this nigga. How did this What I flipped about? Y'all just flip flop. She was standing on y'all. Khalees is Khalees. Bill Murray is funny. Mel is full of shit and has been for months publicly. <laughs> publicly. And nobody well, about this? About, about this? About numerous things. Bullshit. No, JM? About no. JM? About, about numerous things. About you come who? on here and just, but it's fine. Mm, okay. It's fine. But how am I full of shit? You full of shit because you do the same thing. You'll say something, and then weeks later when something else come out, you just like, oh, I, I knew. I, I, I was on the other side in the beginning, oh, but better, I just did it for part of it. You better check my shooting percentage. I shoot like 80% from the field. 80% <laughs> is not 100 or 99. Well, nigga. nobody's 100%. So what was the assumption here that they were going to go to the distance, the yeah, distance, yeah. get married, I, I and live happily yeah, fucking ever after? Love wins. About it. Love wins. Kids. Love wins. Why do you want to acknowledge the Pacino assumptions too? now and not earlier? Huh? Why do you want to acknowledge the assumptions now in breakup, but not acknowledge the assumptions in the hookup? Mm. I wasn't making. I was. I was leaning towards being positive. Mm. 
Really? So being positive would mean that it worked out and they go work the, to go they go the distance, right? When people mm-hmm. announce that they're like, you know, they're in a new relationship, you you wish them well, don't you? Or are you waiting for the fucking, you know, like the the eighteen car pileup? What do you like what are we doing here? I'm gonna come over there and take I'm coming to take that Pam out your house. I'm gonna come get that Pam out of there. It's going right to the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> I see what's going on. Once they start spraying the Pam yeah. on that shit, it's like a whole new, whole new world. We gonna get to you. Okay. Yo, I didn't even say nothing about uh, uh, a few albums. I mean, I don't know if it's music time. We can do some music. Yeah, good. What's up? I mean, my shit would be quick because I, uh, I ain't listen to all these niggas' albums. But Friday drop, it's kind of hard. Okay. I didn't listen to. It. We didn't say nothing. I listened to Russ. Um, it was actually dope. Russ drop. It's kind of hard. Yeah. Victoria Monet drop. We talked about I that. Heard, yeah, I, heard that. Well, I hadn't heard it at that point, I but now that I did. It's hard? Yeah. Some joints on there. It's good. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's cool. Some joints in there I like. Some joints that, eh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But overall, not mad at the effort. Uh, all these shits are just tough to listen to after that Meta project. Mm. That's, that might be r Yo, all jokes is how we play, we play like five of his songs. Yeah. Between, maybe more. between me and you, we maybe, play like five of our songs. Maybe more. That, that, that shit is fire. That's R&B project of the year for me thus far. And with only four months left, I don't think it's soon enough to have those conversations. They, they, um, they asked me in the interview, like, yo, what was your your albums that you, I'm like, they made a shit. And I said, uh, <sighs> Mike. I can't keep up with all your, Mike inter- shit. All your interviews. The made a shit and the Mike shit for me. Have been the two albums of the year. I said I can't keep up with all I your heard interviews. You, I ignored you. On <laughs> is this interview out yet, or is this? Yo, he getting other? better at ignoring me. I'm, I'm gonna learn some tricks. <laughs> yeah. You're yeah. getting better at this the, shit, man. The, the Killer Mike shit and the and the Meta project. Those two projects for me is the two best projects of the year so far. Not mad at that. Mm. Killer Mike shit is great. I'm still on Gunner shit. Same. Killer Mike shit is phenomenal. Gunner show mm-hmm. coming up in a couple weeks. To me. I'll be there. Huh? I said Gunner show coming up in a couple weeks. So, uh, Barkley, I'll be there. I'm not going that shit. I'll be there. I had enough outside for Flip. the summer. I'm not going. No, you had something to say. I had nothing to say. About I did, you did, though. <laughs> no. You did, though. No, what right, is cool. No, he's good. Okay, I got your tongue. Yeah. No. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's just so stupid. <laughs> oh, I'm just saying. Yeah, Part like, of the month, nigga. I like this in the chi- high chair. Right, I'm good. Yeah, he's about to I'm turn good. up. High chair is. High chair is. He's just sat in that too. Nah, yeah. flip a sitting It's house. a different world up there. It is a different it world is. up there. I'm up Air here. a little different? Yeah, you see shit a little differently. I see I. No, I see I. Peace, 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 <laughs> peace. Peace to the behind the scenes people <laughs> interrupting a world class broadcast. Oh, yeah. Don't interrupt again. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so happy to be back with y'all, man. I'm happy to you be back. You missed us? I did. Oh. I got a little sad when I thought I would miss the broadcast. Mm. I did. It's important to me. Mm, I bet. Well, yeah, unlike you. It should be important to all of us. Unlike you, I don't denounce all of the gains that come from being on the Who platform. does that? Yo, don't start. Yo, I'm ready for you. I'm telling you. Yeah. I'm going to start slowing down, articulating my thoughts better. I'm going to start tearing your ass up and not, and not letting well, you round me up. Me? I'm coming Y'all think here. I come in and round y'all up? Well, well I do come in and round y'all up. I do come in and round y'all up. That's true. All right, that's All right, true. Thank you. Except for Flip. Except for Flip. <laughs> <laughs> Try to w- w- wind him down. Yeah, you don't need to round him up. down. But boy, leaps and bounds, you, man. You be killing shit. I was I, so proud of you at the Vince episode. I was proud of you, honestly. Thank you, thank you. But I was, I, I'm calm though most of the time. Yes, I'm on know, I'm only hype when the camera. They, they be talking to no, me like, that. "Yo, dog, flip." Dog. I'm like, "Yo, he don't act like." I was kind of proud of all y'all. He don't act episode. like that. You especially though, because I know for you, when you got two minutes of shutting the fuck up, you start short circuiting. <laughs> 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 for real, if he get quiet. <laughs> Listen to the. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's it. That's what the project is. The ring is made up of down there. All the skin. Ah, uh, wrestling. Ah. <laughs> nah, fuck that. <laughs> How you describe your man? <laughs> nah, fuck that. Hey, yo, you know what's so sad? When I was over there in that chair and I did well on the Patreon that was coming out and you complimented me like, yo, damn. And I said, maybe it's the lights and stuff like that that makes me speak fast and my words come out faster than my brain can compute. Mm -hmm. You gave me a compliment over there. That's what lights do to you? Well, I don't know. Like, sometimes when I'm speaking over here, no, when I'm speaking over here. 
stop because I'm gonna shoot at your man. Look, no, if you shoot at my man, I'm gonna no, shoot listen, at your man. It's when, my man. If you Joe, shoot at my man, I'm gonna shoot at your man. When, we, when I was over there, Joe gave me a compliment like, "Damn, you you doing pretty well." So I said, "Maybe it's the lights." Sometimes I find myself during the broadcast trying to keep up with you guys by speeding. And my, like trying to get my point out at a fast pace. So when the sun out, time. you just be well, fucked I mean, up. <laughs> it's either that or you're really bodying, bodying the performance toward the end of your contract. I mean, it's one of those. Oh, right? that's a contract. Well, my, yeah. I mean, yeah. you know, yeah. you get a contract year. Man, I'm everything I ain't not seeing this my, shit. Come. Hey, 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 no, you're not slick. My I used to do that same shit. Uh, while out for the first four or five months. <laughs> my contract Chill is about to while, end. Yeah. Yeah, hey, yeah. listen, listen. My contract is about to end. Obviously, I don't think that he. Now you got five months here, nigga. Don't scare the fans. My, uh. <laughs> I don't have five. I have, I have four. My contract is about to <laughs> end. <laughs> that nigga and, uh, took off the one whole month. You know, but. Because he keeps saying he signed this contract. Your, a month your later uncle is right, yo. He, he keeps he calling. Your, I texted your him. Your uncle said, is right. I said, Joe, want to holler at you. He said, <laughs> Give my number, man. I'm not, I'm not playing with the kids no more. Whoever y'all look up to and respect and listen to and trust, for real, I want to talk to them. Uh, yeah, hit me. But I, I don't know. I, I, I never understood, because you said that to me, but I, I didn't understand the two-year model thing as far as building. Like, you explained it to me, but sometimes my mind be like this. So I, I hear you, but I don't hear you. I know. But it, it was breaking down like, it takes like, Two years to really build something or keep it cemented as a. I forgot how it was put to me. Some bullshit, but I get it. <laughs> I get it. I thought why, why do niggas sign six months? Why do niggas sign for a year? I don't know and, nobody that signs anything for six months. And you said a, that to me, but that's not true. Company. That's not true, Joe. With what credible company? Oh, you said a credible company. Yeah. Oh, I got it. I see what you're saying. No comp. No credible company in the world is going to invest in you for six months with no language, and then let you run off to reap all the benefits of what they invested in you. That's not happening nowhere with a company. But, that, but, a, but a year. Most companies won't let you do a year. I, I, you so, take to be honest it. with Shout you, out to you. I do that because you're my man. And I want, I want people to be better and go and get money, but most companies don't do that. Because it's, it's a form of We put of the second year as an option. It's, it's foreign language to some people. Like Spotify, when they offered me a deal, it was like three, to, three years or five year deal. Locking it down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, three or five. Yeah, I remember that. So, but everybody was surprised. But you, you, I don't even think you even remembered you gave me a year. No, no, I gave you a year. Oh, I know. It's also an out. Just in case it don't work, you know, I'm stuck True. in a situation for a long Fact. period of time. Because I don't want, y'all, I don't want to be married to none of y'all either. Yes, you, know, you do. Y'all be shitting on me. You love us too much. <laughs> you love us too much, nigga. You just do this for this. When this shit turn off and you go in that corner and take the <laughs> Magneto helmet off, nigga, and it's whatever that nigga name in reality is, uh, Johnson, Joseph, Eric, whatever. Eric, you know what I think about Eric. often? I'll say this and then we can Eric. move on and stop part okay. of our party. Got it. But do you know what I think about often? <laughs> is it a safe space? Yes. No, it's not. Sometimes. Just say it, nigga. It's not really a safe space. Yeah, I'm going to say it anyway. I'm just dramatic. I do think about in the event that let's say your contract came up and it wasn't renewed like we didn't meet the terms got it how would the how would we celebrate your last pod here <laughs> give me a cake <laughs> i can't see <laughs> no for real like you like if Mel, like how would we celebrate the last? <laughs> would y'all would y'all come in happy to celebrate? Like, oh yo, we had a blast. We really killed that's, that. That's the, what a run. That's I, I or thought, would y'all come in? I'm gonna keep. It, I thought about the salt, same thing. Salty and tight, and but, fuck niggas, fuck the bro, fuck it. I'm not even coming. How would you do it though? I, 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 I thought about the same thing. If you come, if it's like if we that's don't, a bad thought. If we no, it's not. Yeah, if you, it's not a bad thought ish. I, ain't, I who am I to say if it's bad or good? I ain't. I just. How would you celebrate if you came? I never me personally, if you and your man, if you and your if, man can't come to an agreement, mm -hmm. no, you won. You won with that one. You ate it. What he said? I never thought about that. He ate with that one. What he said? It's really for these two things. What did you say? We 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 are. The rest of us really friends. I didn't say <laughs> How would you celebrate? Because these niggas want to. He want to. I didn't say two? nothing. I said I never thought about it, bro. Snuff that nigga, yo. I didn't say it was good or bad. I don't know. I never snuff him. How would you celebrate? See, I would bring in balloons, confetti, <laughs> cake, a choir. <laughs> but, well, to the audience, too, but, you have to celebrate, but if, right? But, if I, but it's not, if it's not received right, then I'm going to be tight. Like, I'm going to be here trying to celebrate. Oh, man, yeah. What a year. But doesn't it depend <laughs> we on... We kill. Oh, my God. Remember this time? Remember doesn't this it is? depend on what the contract, like, what... 
the agreement that we couldn't come no. to? I, it, no, no, I would celebrate y'all, period. It don't matter about that. I would celebrate So if, we, if, if a nigga won a lot of money, you, you said, nah, I can't give you that, and then I have to, a nigga, I have to leave, then you're going to celebrate my, my, no, nigga, it flips See, a little. See, and that's what I think about a lot, because I would still celebrate. He the one keeping the money. Wait, you the what? nigga that would be mad you ain't getting exactly, the money. Exactly, I get it. So you celebrate. So why would he be mad? I ain't keeping the money if he walk out the door. Then that I expect that money to go. He said if y'all if y'all didn't come to terms based on some money structure, he said you wouldn't be. Oh mad. no, I'll be I'm saying, No, he shouldn't be. Of course, we, you celebrate. We, yo, I had to. We killed this year. Yo, damn. Sorry, we couldn't get get it together. <laughs> so you get somebody yeah. else. Yeah, guys, got to go to WWE. Find, find, <laughs> find the next budding flip. <laughs> Another nigga willing to yeah. jump on. Come on, let's, let's talk about uh, Drake. Let's Drake, talk about Drake. Drake said he didn't tell us he's gonna put his album out. Yeah, he didn't. At his show, he, um, he addressed people being upset that the album didn't drop last Friday the twenty fifth, and he said, "Hey, I never told y'all that the album was coming on the twenty fifth. That's a sassy fucking response, Aubrey. <laughs> I, I'm I'm in agreement with him. Erickson, don't put the camera on me before I tell you put the camera on me. <laughs> you, you know I'm gonna get sassy when it comes to Drake. I'm, right? I'm, in, I'm on the exact opposite side of. Wait, which side? It said he's in agreement with Drake. I'm, with Drake. I'm with Drake too. I'm Park, with Drake. Park, stop it. I am. Stop it. Fam, but I ain't tell y'all shit. First of all, y'all niggas talking about me. Stop talking about me till I tell you my album coming out. Why are you with Drake? Because he ain't telling nobody. He ain't telling like, nobody. No. All right, hold he on. Teased. First off, he went on stage and said, "I got an album coming in two weeks." For and, his words, and, and for, we can count for two months straight. We no, counted, no, 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 no. No, we no, counted to no. fourteen. He never, he never. We counted to fourteen. We counted to fourteen. I came out and said, "Yo, it's been about two weeks." Yeah, I ain't drop out that you early. Did, I, you did. We get up about to two fourteen, weeks. nigga. You, I did. And get, when we counted, hug, to, nigga. wait. And when we counted to fourteen, it lined up with at around thirteen. Him showing us the album cover, correct? Mm -hmm. Like it normally goes. At around thirteen, Amazon released the fucking date. Hey, for you people out there that are, are really, really stupid, not a little stupid, really stupid, Amazon didn't guess a date. <laughs> That's true. Amazon didn't say, didn't hear him on a tour stage and say, oh, this is when it's coming. There's business behind that. Correct. So, if you want to be sassy with us, nigga, go ahead. I'm still going to buy your shit, but address the real shit. They said you moved because of Burner Boy, nigga. I think that that's blasphemous. I think that you're too great of a nigga to crazy. ever be that's concerned how, that's how, that's about Burner Boy. That sounds great. That's that's how, that's I, agree. I agree And not just that, that Burner Boy date has been set for a while. So it's not like they just found out, oh shit, that wasn't a surprise drop by Burner Boy. That album was coming and that date has been set I for at least maybe a Maybe he looked up for Burner Boy. I don't think, or it could be that too. Yeah, maybe he it looked up It could be that him. too. Could be mm -hmm. that. It could be that too. I think if Drake moved his date, that nigga, he's him. So if yeah. he moved the date, sometimes it's, it's a favor for y'all, like yeah, Young Thug. I fuck with you. Yeah. Yo, dog, you lucky you owe me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> what a power to have. <laughs> no one man should have all that power. But anyway, yeah, I don't believe the Burner Boy shit, but this is cockamamie shit. My, my only thing is, dog, you saw all of this talk. You saw everything. And could have ended it. You could have, just the same way you said, I never told you, same way on Saturday. Why would I do that, though? You said, I, I never told y'all. No. If you're building up hype, see, I'm with that. Yeah. But then don't say after the fact, yo, I never told you. Yeah, that's don't killing, say that. Because that kills hype, right? No, but no. once y'all start well, getting you say, mad at me, up, calling that, me that names. don't kill hype? No, I, I ain't tell y'all shit. Well, because it's Drake. It's Drake. But it kills hype, yo. Nah. You can't, you can't kill the hype. That's my whole point. You can't kill the hype for this Drake project, no matter what. That is true. You can't. He's so annoying. whether you say something Thursday, Friday, or Saturday, you didn't kill the hype. True. So it's either let it go or continue to not address it. You saw all the You played into it with the, putting the album cover up Wednesday. You playing into it. So you playing along with and the game. I'm you not, saw the talk. You knew what everybody... I'm, you knew niggas thought that album was coming from. I'm Friday. totally with yeah, Ice. He likes it. And listen, he's him. But go ahead and creep into October if you want. I don't, mm -hmm. I don't think... He's too scientific to play that game. I do believe him to be him. But once the other hymns and hers wake up and start rolling their shit out too, I think he wants a clear runway to get his Drake shit off, which should be six to eight weeks, which sounds like sometime early September. I do not think he's about to wait around till November to, to sell out. I don't see it. I don't, I don't see be, it. I don't think it'll be that long. I don't either. think it'll be November, but you saying We ain't October. either, but if y'all saying, y'all can't say that when you say he never said a date. Cause he never set a date, never so that date. means we it get could to come anytime. We just yeah. guessing now. Shit could be coming around Christmas. That shit coming Friday, bro. Next yeah. Friday. 
I say within two, within two weeks of all of this. He gonna drop happening. it when we on vacation. Facts, motherfucker. <laughs> just so niggas can talk some shit. He's following the pod schedule. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the JVP. yeah, it's true. It's true. <laughs> he lining them up. That boy's scientific. That's he's scientific. Don't be that guy that used to clown me, nigga Jay, and talking about you. All right, man. All right, you got it, dog. I can't convince you. Until he said button up. I can't convince They still told me he wasn't talking about me. But, so I you, promise you that they still told me he wasn't talking about me. So yeah, they right. said he was reaching. He don't know who you are. You are reaching. Stop he was it. talking about a button up t-shirt. They told me Drake wasn't talking about me. regular Joe Drake got, up. Drake got a song. Pump, pump it up. Nigga, stop. You ain't about you. They told me it wasn't about me. <laughs> said, Say the next bar. Then they said, oh, yeah, yeah, he talking about you. No, but then it's, oh, you wildin' if you mad at that, nigga. You dissing for that. <laughs> and they just hate That's me. That's how I switched. They just hate me. They just hate me, but it's fine. I swear. Fuck y'all. They I said wish you the, the way They said the whole line was, it's literally your name. He says you regular said Joe, Tell button him up. Yeah. Yeah. Tell them regular Joe's Dog, button up. Why you think you regular Joe? Because <laughs> you've been saying your same, you've been I, saying I, I, I'm I regular never, Jizzle. I, I never heard your slaps. Who are you? Tell, it sounds fucked up. I'm telling you, I had to deal with this for years. <laughs> okay. That's Imagine great. that nigga dissing, dissing Ish for years and get to deny it. <laughs> ish running around just tight, smoke coming from his head. That fucked up. These star, these superstar niggas is mean and dangerous. He did that shit way after y'all. It was like fifteen years after y'all was beefing. That was crazy. <laughs> it wasn't even no problems. Joe, Joe, kept, Joe was shooting at that nigga. Joe was shooting at him. Yeah, but still, whenever you felt like it, we did. You'll Dude, let off go. Doing yeah. that shit in 2012 was nuts. I was wrong. <laughs> I was wrong. Here you go. You, you said you was wrong. I was Here you wrong. go. Here you go again. This, I'm wrong. She got Everybody, hold on. Shh. Sir. <laughs> Everybody out there, when you get, for, and I got a birthday coming up, been doing reflecting and shit. Come on, I'm about to be 43. Man, I was about to say, yeah, that's a fact. That's Anybody a fact. out there, when you're 42, about to turn 43, hopefully you look in your 20s and be able to recognize when you did some shit wrong. All right. Mm-hmm. Salute. I wild in my 20s. I'm so thankful for where I am today. But look who you was I'm with, bro. Right? out. I know. Them niggas are battery kings. Swear to God, go do this nigga. <laughs> no, what? They say you a dream, for real. For real. Made me go in the booth and dis hove. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid! As a, as a new artist. <laughs> hey, good luck with that one. Good luck with that. Uh, Drake, some bullshit. I'm not off of that. That's some bullshit. He know it. It is some bullshit. Stop it. But that's how I know this album going to be Even off. the shit, even, even the Yachty tweet. Because he playing. Even the Yachty tweet, which was... Thursday, I think it was. He said, y'all haven't seen any truthful information come out about For The Dogs yet. Yeah, they playing which, with us. Which was his way of addressing, yo, that album's not coming tonight. And then deletes that immediately. Like, somebody say, nah, 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 delete it. Let them think it's still coming. Like, I don't, just, just to play it into it, for what? To come out and say, yo, I ain't tell he you. He pushed nothing. it back so he could add the uh, Bobby uh, Althoff disc. <laughs> Hey, them last oh. minute Drake records be the one, oh, so me, I ain't mad at it. Yeah, you can me, push it back oh, me, again if you need to. Yeah, let me ask. Y- y'all think that he got an album coming and they ain't gonna say nothing about that little white girl that he unfollowed <laughs> and did an interview with and made him take the interview down? <laughs> Drake is sassy, nigga. He checking the girl purse when she go to the bathroom, taking her phone out of here so she don't record and put it on the hardest Just Blaze beat in ages. <laughs> That's what he chose to do on the Just Blaze beat. Actually, I want to hear hey, that. Man. I want to hear that now. We ain't played a single drop of music yet. Fuck music, man. I'm straight, off, I'm straight off a plane. I'm straight I don't want to hear no music, nigga. Oh. You lit? No. If it's 50? Mm. That's that that sounding hard. Yeah, that's Real quick, though. Harder beat. Lord knows or 88. Both Just Blaze beats. Lord knows Lord or 88? 88. Lord Wale 88. What the fuck is 88? A Wale song Wale produced song. by Just Blaze. Yeah. Released in probably 2014, maybe? 15? Very hard beat. Very hard beat. What's, so your, what's your opinion? Lord knows. Clear? I Clear. want to hear it again. Because I don't know what what song we're talking about. Play it. Play it. I want to hear it. And my vote is pumping up anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, hey, y'all can go, go pull up whatever song you want. Any <laughs> Just Blaze tune hey, in the world. I think Pump It Up is the greatest Just Blaze beat ever made, ever composed, ever thought about. And nobody can tell me different. It's not, exactly. None of them is hard and pump it up. <laughs> Sorry. They're not. Salute. Salute. Yeah, I don't, I don't want no sauce. <laughs> Joe Spice. <laughs> Joe Spice. Man, why you just sent that to us in the text group? What she texted? I saw it there. Something about Kanye having his ass cheeks out. Yeah, Kanye. 
Prince. He was getting his she dick. She swear this is. So that's the J and that's the Mike, that's the Mike Jordan Prince on the boat, thing. man. She swear this is the Valley Unlocked. Yeah. Let the nigga get head. He was getting <laughs> head. <laughs> Catching some top on New, the boat. New York Unlocked. <laughs> but Kanye, why you got to take your pants all the way down again? Y'all niggas. That nigga's wearing them pants. Them shit ain't got no zipper or nothing. He got oh, some yeah, weird yeah, shit yeah. on. Oh, some sweat shit. Yeah. Oh, okay. Some leather sweat pants. through the dick hole. Why? That's crazy. You pull your shit through the boxers? No, you take the top off, nigga, but you don't like. What, what is the etiquette for getting head in public? Well, yeah, you gotta, you gotta do. Not, don't do not, it. Yeah, that's not <laughs> etiquette. What? No, no, no. There seems to be. Yeah, there seems to be a formula. Yeah, you're, wrong, you're right. You know? now, there is an etiquette. Hey, yo, nigga. Fam, and when you getting head in public, the last thing on your mind is proper etiquette. Okay, formula. Oh, no, 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 formula for not ex- for not getting around, arrested. And decent exposure, nigga. Right. Yeah, that's the last thing on your mind. That's not true. Free Willie, man. That's not true. Yo, nigga. That niggas be. I Getting your getting head in public is not etiquette at all. Okay, what what's about? the formula for not getting arrested for indecency? There we go. There we go. Don't get there we go. Formula for not getting. <laughs> 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 oh shit! <laughs> Let the seat back. I think the seat does it. something to motherfuckers. <laughs> Talk about this. I'm gonna get as low as possible. Hey, yo, <laughs> let me look through the window. But, to let you on, see, but that's not that's not public. Yo, what? That's yeah, it is. Oh, t- yes, it is in public. Let, you walk, let, public, let public, them walk up to your car. Yes. Watch, watch what happens. I'm gonna make sure the nigga, rear public, view, nigga. Walk, I can see the rear view, and I can get low. And sure they get low. Y'all be parking on the wrong block. <laughs> what block you park on, nigga? Batman block. When I wasn't around, we got tinted windows, so yeah, your shit <laughs> can't see you through the shit. When Ish charmed the uh, the escort that we used to, uh, the two escorts we used to book all the time, when he finally charmed his way into getting her for free, Yo. nigga used to walk her right to the car, boy, <laughs> get in the car. I used to be calling that, Yo, his own what's shit. up? We hitting the spot. Him, that know, nigga would be in the car, him. like, nah, I'm gonna just head on. I'm gonna just head on. <laughs> they they want to rock tonight. <laughs> yeah, all right, nigga. Yeah. yeah. You believe him? Yes. 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 That's yeah. Absolutely. Yes. That's, that's dirty man. 100%. This nigga's a liar. Yo. I'm lying. Oh, that's, man. that's dirty. You never sucked your dick in the car when I wasn't around? Never. Okay, got Yo, it. hold on. Let me ask you a question. <laughs> Yo. I swear to God. Swear. Does Never. that oh, does wait, that fall god? in the line you of be, dirty magic? You be Muslim in September. Which god you talking about, nigga? <laughs> no, you no, you'll you be Muslim in September. Uh, you do go from Joel Stein to Yeah, Oh, man. This nigga's stupid. Into the nigga from Minister Society when he starts talking about him getting shot. Oh, shit. Whoa. Oh, shit. Wait, nah. I wasn't trying to look for that. I was actually looking for Lil Wayne off the Drake conversation. Undisputed intro. He smoked this. He mm-hmm, ate. Mm-hmm. It's before I play this. this I have it. to let the audience know, as a rapper, how hard, how difficult it is to get off in twelve bars. And I, I didn't count this, but it felt like twelve or eight. But and, and to be TV appropriate, by the way, <clears throat> and yeah. incorporate all of the things that topic bait. You know what I'm saying? Wayne is Wayne is. This is crazy to do this on a, a, a sports theme I like song. I like it. I, I didn't hear it. Let me. Hear. I got you. you. Uh-huh. It's new. Yo, that is extremely difficult to do. Shouts what? to Wayne, man. He's fire, but why does he get away with the whole auto tune thing he does? Like, why what do people mean? let him get away with it? That's a shit. He started that. Yeah, yeah. You always uh, do. Yeah, what? He, he started that. Forty pain. As far as rapping through auto tune, he started. Oh, okay, that. All right, be careful. <laughs> <laughs> remember Jay? Nah, 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 nah. Remember that? Just maybe put things in perspective. Jay ain't kill shit. Fuck out of here. He tried. What? He didn't kill nothing. T Pain was mad about that shit, nigga. He said that shit fucked him up. He was mad. They they put auto tune in every. They put auto tune in every single session after. He didn't kill nothing. He He didn't kill it. He He didn't kill a thing. He didn't kill it. And that was fucked up that he tried. It was too many good young niggas eating off auto tune at the time for him to come out here and do that. That's different from him trying to kill Timberland, like all of them. uh, What's the other white? Fucking champagne. It's different from him trying Christophe. to kill all that. Oh, yeah, that's true. It's I got, I got, I give a lot of young niggas eating off auto tune. Don't, true. don't, nah, not right now. So T Pain just, he was mad. That record was amazing, though. He, he was just mad because it's like, you sound like you shit on me. Like, like, if I'm. T Pain should have been mad. He should have been, been mad. He was the Ron king of. Ron Brown suit? <laughs> nope. Ron Browse is my man. That's my man. Say something. Ron Browse is my man. Say so stop. I love Ron Browse, my brother. Yeah, but Say if I can't fire none of your dudes, stop firing my man. I, I got good, I fire I got, Brown. I got good records out of Ron Browse. Of course. And I seen you in the club when Pop Champagne was. Oh, I was. I was in the video. I was at the video. You and that jersey, bro. I do. Oh, you was Pop chasing back then? What? what? <laughs> I didn't cut. That was a good one. No, I didn't cut, but I was there. Yeah, I don't like that niggas try to erase the Ron Browns history from New York. You can't. 
Ether Boy. Hey. <laughs> we about jam, baby. I wouldn't pop his shit. We need more battle. Tell them about Harry. Tell, tell them about Brazil. Hey. 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 That'd be coming like hey. 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 what? Hey. <laughs> that shit was hard. Yeah, that beat used to come on. They got Web Star the fuck out of here. <laughs> no, he did. He, he did dancing on me with Web. Nigga. I know. Oh. <laughs> I'm just talking. <laughs> dancing on me. Hey. Dancing on me. Pulling to the club. Dancing on me. <laughs> Yo, why you know all them shit? That was me. I was around. I was outside back there. It was too. Hey, hold on. <laughs> let I, don't me what, I don't care what he told his wife. Hey, yo, let me. Nigga, you was out there too. Your wife don't know your history. Hey, yo, I ain't gonna lie. To you. <laughs> you a club condor, son. Let me. I got. I got to give it to you, nigga. That ski shit in the club. The what? The ski record in the club. You right? Oh, it came on. Atlanta. I can't say nothing about it because it, they think no. I'm going too it crazy. Came with no, when they, they came think I'm taking on Atlanta, 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 they went ape shit. So you be right. You said, because you said that, I know it's a strip club, so I can't really speak for what the record is going to do, but. It came but it, on in it, Atlanta it did, and the club, huh? it went crazy. For anything to bubble, it got to start at the ground level. I believe Facts. that the strip club is ground, 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 ground level. Ground so. level. I used to be the A case. lot of records popped in yeah, Starless, nigga. Spin mm -hmm. King popped a lot of records in Starless. But my good. fans, uh, for some reason, I don't know why they think I can't. I watched the, uh, that shit on Netflix where they're bigging up the uh, women of hip hop. If you look at it, this podcast is all through there with Joe Budden championing all of the new girlies as they came up in hip hop. Mm. Even the girls I don't really fuck with now. When Meg first came out, I was the first nigga. Yeah. Skip there. I want to support all that. Yeah. So I support Sexy Bread. And they're not paying me for it. They're not paying me. They should pay me. <laughs> what label she on? I should call up there and get a check. <laughs> Ski. But well, they're not paying me. I just, I just. Listen, for that to happen for a St. Louis hood booger project sounding like that, looking like that, dressing like that, Talk talking like it. that. Talk like, about it. So why, hey, 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 mama, go change your family's life. Go yeah. change your family's life. Who gives a fuck how y'all feel about the music that girl is making or That's what y'all think about her aesthetic? Go change your family's life. The end. Fact. The That's fuck? That's all that matters. That's it. Fuck all that bullshit they talking about. Shout I, out I'm to all you. the... All, all the... Uh, Golden gooses out there that come along and change your family's life. Yeah, the rest of your family got to respect you. The fuck out of here. Talk about it. Got to respect it at, the, at Thanksgiving. Yeah, nigga, I'm in this room alone. Get out. Put your coat down. <laughs> Go ahead. Nah, I'm in here with the coats. No, we got turkey now <laughs> instead of Cornish hens. <laughs> Damn. Yo. Yo, what's oh, wrong with you? You can't say that, man. Stop. <laughs> Some, you Some, can't say that, nigga. Who you had Thanksgiving with? You sick fuck? Some niggas don't got turkey, nigga. They got hey, I had a Cornish hen Thanksgiving Yo, one time. It wasn't about. bad. I had two. Can, can yams, right? Yo, I hate to be the guy to say turkey's my least favorite thing on Thanksgiving. Turkey yeah. is the worst, Same. The worst bird meat. Tur turkey's only good the day after. Turkey's fire. You don't like turkey? If you do it right, but a lot of people don't do a it right. A lot of people too. don't do it Dry right. Dry ass turkey. Your yeah. oven ain't even big enough to do it right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're going to do turkey etiquette during when Thanksgiving comes. Like facts. <laughs> Start brining now. Yeah. Sure you right. got to let it. Yeah, yeah. Right. That turkey sandwich a few days that's later. That's, 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 when, that's when the turkey's good. Ether boy. <laughs> hey. yeah. That should be good as hell. Crazy. How you balling, nigga? Yo, it's almost Halloween. I know. <laughs> Are we coming here dressed up as uh, we about costumes? To, we about to die. <laughs> Are we coming here with costumes? You know who you're talking to? That's the problem. Y'all don't know how to enjoy yourselves. Let's come I'm with it. I'm with go. it. I'm with it too. There we go. Okay. Joe and Ishmael dress up all the Halloween. Corey will not be dressed up. Yeah, they will I bet not you, be. I bet you, I bet you, I. They won't be. Hey, if you go, if this, if you act like you're not going to do it and then come in here over the top, I'm popping on you and they're on camera. I'm not going to wear a costume. Good. Okay. So we just going to wear it. Be regular. Because my costume would be a mask, and under these lights, that's too hot for the mask. I do think potting with a mask on is fire, even when it's not Halloween, because then you can really tell the truth. <laughs> I, I'm getting jealous. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm not joking. I get it. It's, it's a few like niggas that... Nigga. No, today it's a few niggas sitting down with like an Iron Man mask. They putting masks Facts. on, and they starting to the pot. And I think it's genius. Because you don't know who they are. My own girl from LA hit me, pitched me an idea for a podcast with like niggas wearing the Daft Punk mask where you just really can be honest and nobody ever know your identity. I thought it was fire. They gotta have to mask your voice. So? No, it would be somebody's voice that you can't recognize anyway. Okay. It would be a new person. Oh, also, a whole new podcast. But it would also be, yeah, yeah. it'd be easy to distort someone's voice. You could distort a voice. Yeah. yeah. What do y'all think of, uh, I played the Wayne's record, but what do y'all think of the undisputed lineup with Michael Irving, Richard Sherman? And uh, 
Keyshawn. Keyshawn, Keyshawn Johnson. Johnson. Uh, so much. Yeah. I, I, I hope that there will be NBA experts at some point. Even mm. though I'm a football guy, like, I don't want to hear these dudes sitting around talking about, about basketball. Like, se- segment two, I think, was LeBron. And I was like, eh, don't really care what y'all think about LeBron. Respectfully. I think it's too much. I think some of the uh, personalities are really, really, really alive. They're all out. They're mm-hmm. really They're strong mm-hmm. personalities. Some, some of them. All, all, all of them. All of them. Every single one of them. All of them. Richard Sherman could dial back a little bit. But Keyshawn and, 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 Mike. and Mike are Mike, Mike a lot. Is, yeah, Mike is a lot. So the I think skips a lot. I, I skips yeah. a lot and yeah. skips a lot and skips a lot. They were a lot because Skip couldn't. Skip had to take the, st- the step yeah, back. Up. Like, yeah. damn. I saw people clowning him for that, but I thought that I was part of his genius. Absolutely. I, I, I wouldn't clown him for that at all. Yeah, you can't clown. Well, the internet yeah. just be clowning. Yeah. But yeah, to have a show where you are able to do that and have people, you're my girl. Man, I ain't been on TV in a while. I'm here to turn it up. Mm-hmm. Ooh, go <laughs> hey, shoot. Get your shit up. You want those people turning up like that. I didn't see it. All I saw was clips. Yeah, I saw clips. I watched it. I watched it. But I don't doubt that they'll be successful. Yeah, no doubt. They will be. Like I said, as a football I just, fan, I like it. But I just think when it comes the, to other sports, the oh. one-on-one beef is gone. And I think a lot of us liked that particular dynamic. You know what I'm saying? Like the one-on-one. I'm sure that they will probably they will break up the party. It will be. It'll probably be more ISOs and... You know, especially as they get busy, it's football season, so those guys are going to be in high demand. So you might be right. That ESPN Shannon Sharp contract taking a while. Mm-hmm. They fighting over something. Yeah, mm-hmm. I wish I knew what they was fighting over. Mm-hmm. I think you got a pretty decent idea. <laughs> <laughs> a little spanking. Well, I wish they close it. Me too. Yeah, close it. They'll close it before we, football season. I got I got to see which show is better now. Promise you that they'll close it. Before well, let me know. Oh, yeah, Stephen A. coming up here soon. So first take is better. <laughs> That's how pod goes. I'm sorry, y'all. Hey, I'm sorry. Get it done. If Skip, yeah. if Skip come up here, I might really engage in which is better. But Skip ain't coming. Skip was a cool dude, though. Let me not do that. Skip, Skip was cool when I met him. But I'll go with first take for now. When the guest is coming up here. <laughs> what you? Yo, what did y'all think about um, Jalen Brown playing in the Big Three All Star game? I think um, I think Jalen Brown is just from what I've seen. I don't know him personally. I just think he's a remarkable young dude, um, and I think like even when you hear him speak, he's mad articulate. He speaks about a whole bunch of different shit. I think um, if any possible way him lending his likeness to Ice Cube would promote Ice Cube, I think it's fire. It's my personal, you know what I'm saying? Like if if it would help Ice Cube in any way, shape, or form, I think it's fire. Which I believe it. Actually, that's exactly what it did. No, that's true. There you go. I think Bernice had a gig around the corner. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Fuck I'm going to go do this for a couple of hours. Yeah, yeah, you can't you go over Handle your handle. I'll be yeah, over here. I think she was going to head down or some shit. He didn't, <laughs> didn't want to be bothered. run this real quick. I'm going to go hoop. Yeah. I'm going to go Either that or Bernice wanted to go to Big Three. Anything Jalen mm-hmm. Brown do, I'm putting on, on Bernice now. <laughs> you young niggas got your head in a frenzy. <laughs> You think I think that y'all have control of yourselves? You think I think y'all are disciplined enough to not do whatever the fuck she say? I probably do? I probably go play basketball. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, <laughs> yeah. When Adam Silver called, <laughs> not right. thing the thing that helps you get. Yeah. Oh, okay. Go out and get injured, nigga. Trying to be cute. Talking about yeah, it's for black people. <laughs> Somebody gotta do it though. Somebody gotta do it, man. Somebody gotta take the step out there. And I just, trust him. <laughs> no, okay. I'm getting better too. Right? I, li- I like, I like oh, personally. Man. I like, I like, I like to see people putting action behind Super words dope. and shit. I appreciate because anybody else could have did it. I like it too, man. That team is gonna be sick. Jalen Brown and DeAndre Aiden get out there. <laughs> <laughs> is I not coming off the bench? <laughs> Yo, y- y- y'all are nuts, bro. That's the big three. <laughs> That's the big three. <laughs> 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 um, shout out to Skip good, good luck with the new Undisputed man uh, I hope y'all do well What else did I can't find my phone Oh Fiery Fest My, my, my nigga's back <laughs> Same back. dude Not the same dude Billy. Same, yeah, same Billy. dude Billy's back Billy. 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 Billy McFarlane yep. Billy back bro mm-hmm. Yo the whites just got some balls on them yo. <laughs> What the and fuck they, And they said the tickets are sold out mm-hmm. Yo that's and just it was like 500 a pop For the cheap ones For the cheap seats Yo, the whites, yo. They the, yo. Just run it back. Run it, oh, hey, it worked the first time. Run it back. You heard Roy Johnson? Yo, if he got some. Pro- 
Roy can't come and start another school right now. He is. Head. He's still doing it. He didn't finish the duck. <laughs> He's still doing it. <laughs> 100%. Yeah, 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 you like it. I swear yeah. to God. No. Still you got to finish it. Shut the Roy. <laughs> I want to see that what? versus the white, the white scammers versus the black scammers. Like mm. the scammers. It's not even scammers. close. Yeah. Different. Not even not close. Right. Yeah, it's they could get nice. in rooms with... We mm-hmm. can't get in. Them niggas pretend to be security guard and get Congress meetings and all that. Bro, they can go shit. get a suit and a tie and get on yeah. there and get to. Yeah. 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 Nigga, they went and created a Federal Reserve. I'm only white looking, scammers is up. I'm looking for 100 million <laughs> in seed capital. Yeah, well, I'm bugging out. Minimum buying 100 million. And they have, like, America. <laughs> Which they <laughs> took this scam. Word. Yeah. Duh. They won. Yeah, yeah they got it. I think there'll be a day where now. Nah, no, it won't. Pharma- <laughs> pharmaceuticals. Stop that right now. No, it won't. We sell heroin. They sell they lock, Xanax. They lock niggas Duh. up for weed. Duh. And now they selling weed. Duh. <laughs> Stupid, though. They got niggas doing life for weed. And they selling it. <laughs> what are you talking And about? making money off the incarcerated. <laughs> <laughs> you make license plates. We take your hustle. Ta-da. <laughs> All right. You know what? You know what? Fuck, fuck it. Fuck it. It's legal now. It's legal now. Yo. Fuck everything. But y'all the- stay there. Yeah, yeah. Y'all stay there. <laughs> Yo, that's nuts, bro. So nobody cares about Billy McFarlane and the Five E Fest. What if it works? It's gonna work. What if it's legit? It's definitely it's gonna work. work. No, the crazy part is for it to really work, he probably has some backing. I'm sure. They yeah, got, he's got backing. They got brand recognition now. <laughs> Scammer. <laughs> yeah. That's your brand? Yeah, fuck it. How much you need? Huh. They got Think about that, yo. 10 hours worth of content out just about the festival, yeah. Yo, that is crazy, B. Now let's just do it right. Yeah, <laughs> Billy, I'm going to go. I'm gonna give you 10. Once I see it's legit, I'll come back and get another 10. They didn't announce any lineups or anything, though, did they? No. Mm-mm. Who's going to be the first to sign off on that one? Buying the tickets without the lineup is nuts. Word. From it's a all, scammer? It's all part of the that scam, man. crazy. They ain't put no tickets out. Since they can't. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> of course, they're going to get the weekends and see free. Both of these fighters have dealt with custody battles involving their children. <laughs> the fuck that got to do? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Wait, no, no. <laughs> Wait, what was that? So they, UFC commentator while these dudes is nah. fighting. Nah, now nah, we got to fight. That's what they do. Both of these fighters have dealt with custody battles involving their children. <laughs> no, no wonder he throws that uppercut with such force. <laughs> that <is laughs> what are you talking crazy. about? That's crazy. Yo, what did y'all think of what did y'all think of the clip making his rounds uh, about homeboys saying why does the NBA why does the NBA put world champion when they win a title when it's uh, only and then all the NBA players killed him? Uh, Noah Lyles was his name. Such a goofy ass up. All right, so y'all disagree? Yeah. Yeah, I disagree. Because can't none of you niggas beat us. N- not just that. That's it, why I disagree. The NBA is comprised of people from all over the world. Some of the best players in the NBA, damn, they're all of them now. If you take the top 15 NBA players, I'm sure at least 10 of them are from other countries. The NBA is the world champions because they're the best in the world. They got to beat somebody, though. We, we play, nigga. You go get the U.S. Line, Olympic team. Yo, go we'll line them up. Against the, it don't matter. Go line them up. Go, get, go pick your, be- yeah, your country's think, best. But I think that was his point. Until you line them up, how you can you call yourself the world champion? Because it's, it's... I understand it. All right. Mm. It's like almost... But I do think that there is a little validity in what I, I he's saying. He's just ignorant for not acknowledging I, that the NBA represents the best players in the world. That's one. And then now you're just being... Uh, uh, semantic man because you know that if you go line up the best players from Hungary, Poland, Kenya, we're going to wipe the floor with them. We do it every four years. Yeah, I, duh. They lost a couple of them. No. Ar- Argent- Argentina beat us in one of them years, right? That was before the pros was really starting to take that shit seriously. Yeah. Let us lose. No, it when, smokes when, when, niggas when, when the real pros come out. <laughs> not the niggas that be like, nah, I'm good. I don't feel like playing. Let Steph and them get hot. Yeah. Touche. Nigga start shooting from the balcony. <laughs> what are you talking about, nigga? Don't get your man, yo. He over yo, here. Yeah, don't let now me argue. Now y'all over there arguing. Yo, bro, he in the parking lot. You want me to go out there? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. What <laughs> fuck are you talking about? Nigga, you shooting from the pool. They pulled up this Greg Popovich quote from 2010 that kind of agrees. It says, it doesn't make sense for an NBA team to call themselves world champions. I don't remember anybody playing anybody outside our borders to get that tag. I'm assuming it's legit Bleacher Report posted this, and this is him in 2010 saying that. But even it's different for Popovich saying that 
in the league than homeboy saying it. And it was it 2010. The influx. It, we we had some. Farm, oh, in 2010, that's when we was getting beat. And we had farm born players in 2010, but we didn't have an influx like we have now. Again, Greek freak is uh, Luca. And it's with the Nassus. His what? brother. Greek freak. What? He resigned. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all just not shitting on the Nassus, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yeah, yes, Senna, what's his name? Joel and B. You just got well, so he many. He took the Sixers off his bio, so we can stop saying that to Ace. That's true. We don't know. He might, he, might the, he might be the next center. Fuck y'all, all right? And B hey, is yo. still a Sixers center. Hey, yo. Look, look at his face. Look, <laughs> look. I don't play into those rumors. Exactly, me neither. However, I'm, I do know that the Jalen Brunson contract is cheap enough for the Knicks to potentially acquire two max players two maxes. if they do it correctly. Two. Two it's maxes. just about when they decide to do it. I am personally waiting on Donovan Mitchell's contract to be up in Cleveland. Every off season, he come over there. Are you away? You got your pills? No, you thinking, taking medicine, nigga? No, I am not something. No. You, you, you. no okay, okay, okay. Um, i that's fucked. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. You can't let a nigga doze off. No, I, I take a little no, nap, nigga. No, I didn't doze I'm off. I'm tired too. I'm tired. No, I was breathing, nigga. Damn. Oh <laughs> shit. That's, how, tell you that's how fat niggas breathe. No, I was, just, I was about to call an sleep. ambulance. I tell you, what holy care. shit. I'm sorry, yo. Chill. We need to get a gurney. <laughs> Anyway, Donovan Mitchell every off season, uh, off season, come to New York, put on a, a clinic, and make you want him on the Knicks. So I'm waiting for his contract to be up. That's it. And he want to play with New York, right? Yeah, I know. Yeah. And we'll take the tamper in charge. Y'all ain't do shit to Dallas. Just see Dwight Howard's car starts up with his championship ring. I did see that. I gotta, I gotta give Dwight Howard some props, man, because oh, he pressed you. Never. <laughs> you see his shit? Big, big nigga. <laughs> and, and I wasn't with you in Atlanta to hold it down. With you. you gotta just run. Why all this cool? You gotta just run. I'm not getting into that, bro. Anyway, <laughs> niggas really went and delved into the AD versus Dwight Howard to be on the top 75. I, I apologize to Dwight Howard. He definitely need to be there. I agree. He definitely needs to be there. I might have not have agreed before, but I agree. Yeah, now. yeah, I did. I, I just, before, I take it back. How come when you apologize, your voice gets real low? <laughs> you must proceed apology. Yeah, yo, why you don't say it yeah, with the same what type what you, of uh, confidence, that authority that you speak with, like on Bad Freeway Well? Yeah, yeah. For real. I seen your little interview on LinkedIn, too. <laughs> yo, I, I seen what? It. LinkedIn joint? I, I seen him on LinkedIn. Yo, it's yo, a tour. Wrong it's just out it's here, son. Yeah, but he got to switch up his shit. He keep taking the same shit. Right, on LinkedIn, he said, yeah, man, we can just talk about so many different things. <laughs> yo, what's wrong with this nigga, yo? Stop you didn't do a speech down there in Atlanta? No, nigga. Stop your buff. Yo. You are just going to lean, lean into this bullshit. I thought they would maybe like, let you be an opening act or something. Open somebody. Act. <laughs> something. <laughs> somebody. <laughs> Yo, and why now we funny? have why you Ian Dunlap. Yeah, why you think? Why you can't be an opening act down there on the best fest? What's an opening act? There's no such thing as an opening act in the best fest. Yeah, a person best, speaking yeah. before you speaking early. Yeah. Wow, you wow. Speaking, oh, that's what you call it. You they ain't the, even yes, get here yet. Yes. You get the brunch, the brunch crowd. Yeah, you get the early niggas. <laughs> Nigga, get here at nine a.m. Say something. <laughs> Warm it up for before you're the early. Good morning. Warm it up. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Fam, I be in that motherfucker. If you're early, you're late. That's that's where you start. Yeah. You got to be early to get the information. Yeah, I just shit on. Chat. You would, but you wouldn't try. To, you wouldn't try to speak on that stage like next year. Yeah, of course. I definitely thought you'd have been after last year. You was for sure going. Nigga, he spoke year. in Dominican Republic. Didn't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, he Atlanta's a thing. I got it. I got it. I got it. Anyway, I got it. I'm not listening. He to you. spoke in the Dominican he Republic. Us back. He see how this what, what was the crowd like in DR? It wasn't a lot. It was thirty something people. No, what was the crowd like? Was it like? Dominicans or was it? No, it wasn't no Dominicans. Oh, we got in, in DR over there. Oh, there's no Dominicans in DR. That's crazy. It was no Dominicans at the engagement that I spoke. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, no, you need wasn't letting them in. He just did what the whites did. He <laughs> <laughs> wasn't letting the people of the town come here and speak. Yeah, and you just did what the whites did. Get some help. That's crazy. Yeah. Did what we? You know what they did to us? Uh, that's that's not. <laughs> oh, oh sorry, we can't say. No, Native American. Wrong. Yo, dog, what's, wrong? Wrong? <laughs> yo, what's wrong with your brain, yo? My brain? What's wrong with yours? Let him in. It wasn't my event. Should have let him uh, in. And they I'm, could, I'm kind of disappointed in you. I thought, out of not my event. I thought out of everyone, you would have let the Dominicans in. It's not my event. No, no. Hey, let five of them niggas in here. <laughs> they was in there. They was. Oh, wow. Wow. oh my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Parks, right? Please, Parks. <laughs> he didn't hear it. Look. Oh my! 
Out of here. <laughs> Whatever happened, I missed it. Oh, no, man. No. You can't sit in that chair no more. <laughs> <laughs> nah, well, they, somebody tell me about uh, what this is, Speed uh, Speed Bows Down to the Twitch CEO. I saw it. I just am not familiar with Speed. Um, another popular streamer Got on it. Twitch that had gotten banned. Why'd he get banned? Uh, from what I was reading, it was something sexual. Oh. Like, I don't know if it was uh, had somebody exposed it. I'm not sure the full mm. detail, but I saw the word sexual. Was it a white kid? No, he's not white. Mm. Black kid. So there was some event. And disaster's black. Disaster is black? No. Oh, okay. I thought you was Today they just make anybody black. I thought you was refuting that. I'm like, wait, no, I just pulled the picture. Not he's black. not black at all. But the kid Kostanat was there, mm -hmm. and he went to the, the CEO of Twitch, and they had the kid speed, like, bowing down, bowing to him in attempts to get restored. Did it work? He said he'd think about it. Mm. Damn. That's fucked up. So I don't know if he's... Which part what? is... What's fucked up? The, the, fact, that you the fact that he had to fucking tuck bow. his dick in balls, bow down to the motherfucker, and then he's like, mm, I'll think about it. Well, well, he won an award, right? Yeah. Variety uh, Streamer of the Year. He's a popular streamer. This is only a topic because of the bow down in front yes, of the white man. I've yes. been here long enough. We never had this conversation about speed. I don't know who don't speed know who is. is. I don't want to ensure he's successful, but this is only making the rounds because he bowed down to a white man, similar to Meek doing the bunny hop in front mm. of Michael Rubin, uh, similar to uh, Bobby Schmurder on the, on the table. table. Uh, like We've seen this. We get outraged over it. What is it called? Emotional outrage. So what is it called? The behavior it starts with a... Shucking and driving? Cooning. Cooning. Cooning, got it. This is what they mean when they say cooning and shucking and jiving. Got it. I don't... I'm, I'm, you don't listen, agree? I know, what some I, of these top, not, I know what some of these top streamers make a year. Mm -hmm. You would bow to. I know what some of them make a year. So... I wasn't trying to be funny. For, some, for so someone... They, they make a lot. For someone... To snatch that away, whether it be something you did or not. Like, like, we see Boosie when he was up there begging Zuckerberg to give him his account back. Mm -hmm. Like, for a lot of people, just to snap of a finger, losing a certain amount of money that was coming in, damn near guaranteed every month, mm -hmm. you'll bow down. You'll, you'll do what you got to do not to a lot down. of them. Not I'm saying a lot of people would. <clears throat> they've done less for, for less. I mean, less. they've done more yeah, for less. More excuse for less. me. I think, I, I think you're right. I think it's a manner of bowing down in a professional sense. Like, I might have my people calling their people, but for me to physically go there and bow down in front of somebody, that's I mean, these are young kids. They're young Why, why niggas is taping it? Early 20s. This if I'm bowing young. down, put your phones away. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't about to be no record of this. I don't think that's wild to ask, yo. <laughs> Lock this shit something about the bow. <laughs> yeah. Go get the little bag from the comedy show. Because the bow lives on for, for eternity yeah, now. But I do understand, mm -hmm. Ice. For that type of coin that they're making, you're going to bow down. I'm with you. Never me. No, I would bow down. Di Privately. Diplomatically. No. Like, I would have my people. My Figuratively. 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 That's, that's, not, bowing that's not bowing down. down. Yeah, it is. No, 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 no it's not. In the other room? No, it is. <laughs> that's not bowing down. <laughs> no, you, you could that's be a conversation with your business partner. No, you could be kissing ass behind closed doors. But Even that, But that's still true. a conversation still not, with your no. business partner. I know. I'm and you bow down, you could kiss ass. I ain't about to kill nobody for kissing ass to their business partner. Especially when you're making that much. The bow, the bunny hop, and the table dance. Physically. It's like that shit Lizzo did, too. Well, what's that shit Lizzo did? The banana. <laughs> <laughs> You've been trying to get <laughs> no, no. Yo, you just be sitting, Yo, at, the three, they had sitting up, at the three-point oh, line man. like so this. The <laughs> Lizzo, you lucky my memory is bad. Uh, but she's, she's, got on, she's fighting back. She, it's too late. Yeah, it's you're too right. late. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, he looked crazy. And, and, the, and the Twitch guy was telling him to get up. See? Get up, man. <laughs> no, get up what? Look, yeah, get up, look, look. Get up what? Get up, man. Look. Not man. All right, I don't care enough about speed to unpack this. But it wasn't, yeah, it wasn't just about the act of, you know, See? what somebody would have to go through to, when you don't control, basically, your brand. Equalizer 3. Somebody else having that access over your brand will make you have to bow down to them. If, if Hey, you don't have to get it back. Like Joe, you said you wouldn't do it. You go start off somewhere else and build up all over again. Some people on the other side is going to say, "Damn, y'all." No way, I, but that that's not I never said I would do that. No, I'm saying the type of person you are, you're not going to bow to him. I'm You've not, already told us like, "Yo, if this don't work, I'll go and 
make it over here somewhere. Like true, but you snatching my shit away from me don't tell me that it's not working. It's just telling me you snatched my shit away. Mm-hmm. So to each point, I'm gonna have the con- the proper conversations behind the scenes to see how we can advance this mm-hmm. to rectify. Yeah. And if some of that come with kissing ass, depending on how much Apologies, money make, then maybe yeah, I'll yeah. Kiss accountability, ass whatever the case I'm may be. I'm only referring to the physical bow. That's all. Yeah. Anything else, I do understand. We are we are in a recession and COVID is back, and they're not telling us a thing. Mm-hmm. So whatever niggas got to do to keep their lights on, their water on, and their bills paid, I'm not about to come on my broadcast and shame you. It's, it's get, about to get scary out there. Mm-hmm. Prep for a long winter. Mm-hmm. Like Game of Thrones. Mm-hmm. I think I think in the next four or five years they're not saying nothing. <laughs> shit about to get real spooky. So everybody hold on to your spanky, hold on to your money, sure all that enough. shit. It's about to be the world changing drastically too. Coming from Atlanta and just seeing, you know, I was at Lake House and just looking around, being nosy, pocket watching. Boy, that dollar stretches out there. It does, mm-hmm. yo. It I, does. I ain't gonna hold you. I could certainly Bruh. see why people get the fuck up from New York. And go out there. What you get for your money out there is just it's ridiculous. Just different. It's not even just. It, it's. It I told y'all this when I moved. 10 and 15 million in New Jersey. For what he got. Some of that shit. When I oh. moved out of here and moved to PA. And granted, that's not Atlanta at all. But the same. You had the same. Uh, re, 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 excuse me. Revelation. Mm-hmm. You don't. Especially growing up here. Both. Living here your whole mm-hmm. life. Both you think this is the norm. What was the word? Revelation. 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 What was the word? Say, spell it for you. <laughs> Why are you shooting at me? <laughs> but um, yeah, you don't realize it. You you think this shit is normal until you go move somewhere else and you start hearing prices and realizing, hold up, wait, I can get how much for this back home? That's no, nah, my man. When I when I was in the, uh, nothing. When I went to DR. Wait, which friend of yours was this? When I went to DR. Corey, no. No. Yeah, Corey, Corey no, no. Yeah. When I went to DR, oh, a nigga I went to high school with was out there. He's my man. And he was telling us what he paid for taxes in Charlotte. And I was like, his wife was like, no, they went up on our taxes, $300. And I was like, yo, if you don't sit down, yo, $300. Niggas out here, they taxes was like $2,100 for the year. And I'm saying, fam, out here, niggas taxes be 30 and 40 grand in moderate homes. They don't be extravagant, crazy homes. The niggas taxes be 25 band. You know what I'm saying? Like for regular shit. Out there, you could get a 5,000 square foot house and your taxes be minimal what we paying for damn near 1,200 square feet. Mm. And you I know ain't what I'm even, saying? I ain't even just talking living. Like, yo, your insurance be cheap. Your insurance be cheap. Your utilities be cheap. The grocery, grocery store. Car, everything nah, but, be but that cheaper. But ga- that gas to ga- crack ga- your ga- head. Gas, gas to crack your head. Yeah. But you know what I'm saying? Just the cost of living is just easier in some of these areas. For sure. Yeah, and if you don't... If you don't Ever live anywhere else, you won't realize it. No, this shit is different. You will you'll sit here and think this is normal. That's why I was like, bro, I'm never living in Jersey. Bro, I'm on what? A, I'm mad. My nigga, I'm on the boat. I'm out. My man is building some. You was driving a boat? No. I don't play with them games. I don't swim well enough to be playing around with no boats. But yo, nah, I'm 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 in Atlanta. And uh my man is building some shit. And the shit to just look like boarding schools that he building. And I'm like, what the fuck? Mm. But the numbers that he's telling me because we, you know, we in a construction game. The numbers that he's telling me that he paying for the labor out there, it's a joke. Mm. It's a fucking joke. And I'm like, I got you. That's the difference in Cowboy Stadium and Giant Stadium. Giant spent more. You be in Giant Stadium, seats like this. <laughs> you know? You know, fucking seats like this in Giant Stadium. Did Texas, the Giants spend more? They spent more. Yes. How much more? I want to hear that. I, I think don't believe that. like damn near hundred million dollars more, two hundred million more. I am not. Then the I'm new, I'm not then the Cowboy um, Stadium. Wow, I promise you. Oh, that's just huh? It costs more mm-hmm. here. That's what mm-hmm. I'm saying. Like, yo, that's, that shit is different. That's ridiculous. And, and when you go to Cowboy Stadium, that shit is night and day. Not no disrespect to I've the I've never Giants been Stadium. there or Portugal. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Or DR for that. No, I never had a Maybach. <laughs> Yeah, stop, stop, yo! Fix your face, you nigga. Mad, yeah, I know. I when know. we get back from break, I'm firing on you <laughs> for, for no reason. <laughs> Who is this here? Three hundred million more. Excuse me. Three hundred million more. See, I, th- I said it was a hundred. Jerry two. Jones is getting some tax breaks going on out there. <laughs> he, done, no. he done bypassed some laws. Nah, I think nigga. Mexico, right there. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got somebody from part of the show that really needs our help. Got gotcha. you. Okay. Like seriously. I only read the first line. Okay. I won't even say this guy's name. I'll keep him anonymous. But he says, 
I'm at a crossroad, and I'm really thinking about beating my girlfriend's dad up. I don't know if she's just a daddy's girl, but she's terrified of him. If she misses his phone call, you would think the world was ending. I've seen something like this before. I thought when she moved out, things would get better, but it hasn't. Honestly, it's making me mad just watching it, and when I bring it up, all she does is cry. The mom tried to talk to her, but she's just as scared as she is. I'm at my wit's end because he asks me, was I scared of him? Oh, he asked me, was I scared of him jokingly? So I know he finds all of this funny. Is there another way to stop this without beating his ass? Yeah, a man to man. You got to have a different type of man to man conversation. What does that look like? I would like to know how old Shorty is. Um, but he's, she says the mom's also scared too. So, so you know something potentially was going on behind closed doors that have them shook. Yeah, it sounds like you know at saying? minimum he ruled with like an iron fist. Mm-hmm. But when he started asking me, you scared of me? No, nigga, I'm not scared of you. And I say, I won't call him a nigga, but no, not even remotely close. And while we on that topic, yo. Why are you terrorizing your fucking family for? Or one of the, ish- the times when um, I've had this happen to me uh, um, where my girl's dad was yelling at her to the point where you'd be like, whoa, 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 nigga, you know I'm sitting right here? You know what I'm saying? You be right there about to say something. But um, I think that when a conversation might get disrespectful or if you see him treating him in a certain way, now it's here. He what, brought the conversation to you. What circumstance would her father be yelling over at Over traffic. A, it was over traffic. Oh, but some okay. people rule like that. You know what I'm saying? Some mm-hmm. people rule. Some men rule their house like it's that. It's interesting that he said, you know, I don't know if she's a daddy's girl. Mm, no. Yeah, like He's off. Yeah, he's off on that because being a daddy's girl, you know, you have a a healthy dose of, you know, not fear, but like an enormous amount of respect for your dad. You know what I mean? Like your dad, especially if he's present in your life, plays a very, very, very important and very specific role in his daughter's upbringing. Mm -hmm. So, you know, fear... I always used to call it like a healthy dose of fear. All my dad had to do, if I was acting up, all my dad had to do was look at me. Give me the look. Just give mm-hmm. me the look. He didn't mm-hmm. have to raise his hand. He didn't have to say anything. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. I am so no sorry. Loss, yeah. Exactly. That's not. That's not that. That's not that. That's not that. Mm-hmm. There's. I think a deeper conversation else. needs to be had mm-hmm. with A, the dad, or B, my partner. And I'd, I'd not oh, and, I'd say definitely. and I'd definitely I, But say it and. sounds like He might have already Had those conversations With his well, he girl said Every time you bring it up She, she starts crying So then maybe they need Some well, kind of mediator need to sit through the crying No yeah. but he might have Sat through I'm saying But I think They've had conversations already Is what I'm saying And It's not like he at least Tried to Yeah Like you no know, This is a conversation With the dad If she's not telling Then that's telling True True Yeah to me, it sounds like if she's not if she's not telling, and I go off of assumptions from that conversation, then I'm not going to have no talk with him. My behavior, like you said, when he make the joke, is going to let you know what it's time it is know. from this point forward, yes. and I'm now the man here. Yes, that I, is true. I, I now have that to protect a... on a different level, true. and because I don't know what's going on, but I see the effect that you have on my partner, nigga, you no longer allowed over here. Don't call that phone no more. Right? No. Or when I'll, you, I'll when have you, the fights with my no, girl over it. No, when you call it on the bullshit. That's yeah, give me my, that phone. That's yeah. my cue. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's my cue. Hey, big do- hey, big dog. Where you at? Mm-hmm. What's going on? Oh, no, where you What's at? I'll be over there in a minute. Well, what do you need? What mm-hmm. do you need? But you're not going to keep having that effect on my girl. True. No. True. Mm-hmm. And I'll come. Where you at? I'll be over there in a minute. <laughs> but it does read to something deeper going on. Yeah. I, 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 I would see if my partner is open to some uh, therapy session mm-hmm. with somebody that's a little more skilled in extracting this True. type of information. True. Because... Clearly, it's not. She's not ready to tell it to you. Whatever it is, but something is there. Yeah. It's definitely something. Something, right. something is definitely there. Agreed. And that's craziness. But he's in a tough spot. I just, I, I think that the, uh, the, the answer is a conversation with the dude. Because he evidently knows the effect that he has on them. Mm. For him to ask him, "Yo, are you scared of me too?" Maybe though, but no, Joe's right about there having to be some kind of like a, a, like mediation through a therapist I'm, where, I'm, where, where she can talk about it because I agree she's, with that. she's it sounds like she's not ready to tell him to tell him, him I agree what, with that. and honestly if she might call herself protecting the boyfriend. Because I know if I tell you what's going on, you might go over there and blow his brains out. Exactly. So if like thinking about Or protecting how, both of them. True. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thinking yeah. about like the worst possible scenario as to what could have possibly happened in her household, you know, with her 
with her father, that might not be a, you know, a, a landmine he wants to fucking walk on. You know what I mean? Without having... She don't want him to walk on. Yeah. Because he might be really ready to dive on it. She might not want that. With the two most important men in your life, you definitely don't want them at odds. Yeah, sure, and sure. she might just... Either way, the father too. She might know this nigga's crazy or he's great. Like, the second I put this out, they're going to... Yeah, it's going to be a crossroads and, and they could go left. Because the father could be one of them. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Some of the, you know what I mean? Some of these fathers be them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Find that out first before you go talking to my dad. You, you, you still you mm -hmm. don't have a choice. You have, yeah, you don't care about that. You don't have a choice. All right, then put now your, you, life, put your No, no, you might line. navigate the conversation a little differently. Uh, yeah, so you, so you have a choice. <laughs> hey, you're no, big, no, no, it's, hey, it's a big dog. Let me talk yeah. to you for a minute. It's a conversation. It's a conversation that got to be had regardless. Have the conversation. Yo, much luck. Much, much luck to your situation, yeah, man. Mm -hmm. That's a tough spot to be in. It is. For, for because now you... So look, here's the thing. If he does put hands on her father, it may have a, a big effect on their relationship. Absolutely. If if she if her mind is that warped or, you know, if it could be whatever, we don't... Worst come to worst. It, it can have a big what's effect. The, what's the other side of that coin, though? Um... You can save her, I guess. No, if you don't have the conversation on, on the father, it's weighing on your relationship still. But, but we talking about. I mean, put hands on the father. Putting hands on the father. That same thing. No, I don't think so. He, he go and put his hand. He go and beat her father up. A lot of shit after that. It's going to change. It's going to change. Hundred percent. If she, and if she might, and she can take the father's side. The only way, the only way, no, the only way that may slide. The that you got to worry yeah, about. Now you go beat the pop's ass and she took and she takes pop's And out. the only way that mm -hmm. slide is if she confided in you of what happened. Or you go to jail and then dad come over and whoop her ass. Mm -hmm. Yo, this nigga did this to me when I go, what? Boop, 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 boop. And she went, like, it's, 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 it's a it's tricky a tr situation. It's, a, it's a very tricky. To speak to somebody, have, you know, go to speak to somebody who's a professional. Definitely have your, this field, your girl please. go speak to somebody. Definitely have your girl go speak to somebody. I'm going to let him know without letting him know. I know that. All right, I am going to end this podcast, but I'm going to give it a minute to wait to see which one of my co-hosts secretly gets up from the recording to go to the back, get the cake, bring it out. Someone starts happy birthday. Maybe I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah, I know we're not in there. I know somebody brought me a cake. <laughs> somebody did. Ish came late. I knew that's why he was late. Uh, can't yeah, trick he probably me. wanted to get a cake. Y'all can't trick me. Nigga went to Carvel for me. <laughs> so you know how we do on birthdays. Yeah. You but it's not it. my birthday. All right. That's why it's cool for us to, to do it today. It's not my birthday. We can bring out a little cake. Niggas, boy. <laughs> Man, niggas in parks. <laughs> <laughs> niggas in parks, yo. And Mel, the sole reason we hired a woman here. Is to bring cakes. To that's handle, a fact. Yeah. To, to handle bring the cakes. cakes. To, yeah. to cook the cakes. That's, that's inappropriate. And she doesn't cook it. No, she said she's a monster. She's bringing cook. cakes and hiding it in that fucking bean bag. <laughs> 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 Don't come back from break looking like, and I let it, I let it live. Leave I ain't saying nothing. Alone. I ain't saying nothing. No. I ain't Jesus, saying nothing. Yo, Jesus. The I didn't wheel. say nothing. Stop you caping. You know what? Guess Stop what? Stop caping. I like that. Stop nigga. caping for your goal. Guess what? <laughs> <laughs> 700,000 <laughs> no. no The contract is different But yeah it would be No 1.5 1.5 <laughs> Two <laughs> Don't keep playing With Big Mel in here Light y'all asses up <laughs> Mel have all Pay of fucked up, up. There'd be no more podcasts It's the end The Mel tears Is gonna hit different On the Big Mel <laughs> Salute Mel you look, you look amazing Thank you What is uh, What is everyone's plan For Your birthday No for the break well, we're going to celebrate your birthday. Yes. Yeah, yeah, for sure. We're going to definitely we're gonna celebrate you, King, you know? That's mm -hmm. it. The whole time? No. <laughs> oh. We're going to Jamaica. Okay. Again? I didn't go to... <laughs> I was about to say, you don't know no other country. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Yo, other ones. Yeah, stop trying to play with my man. Your man won't leave Elizabeth. Don't hey, yo, talk to my man. Hey, yo, son, don't talk to my man like that. They your, both man won't my leave, man. your man won't they leave Elizabeth. They both my man. Uh, Chill out. Now what? Fuck out of here. They both my man. <laughs> Chill out, son. Hey, let me stop playing with Freeze. Freeze <laughs> just left. Son, yeah. move, nigga. That's true. You just left. You show that when Pump It Up came on. I'll take it back. i take it back. Act like you go. Y'all hold it down at it. What's everybody doing for the. Oh, you going to Jamaica? What's everybody else doing? I'm keeping it light. Keeping it light too. Oh man. Ah, it's my guy. Man. See, see, yes, my man, my man right there. Love, love. Thank oh my God. Happy birthday to me. By the time I come back, 
I will be 43 years old. I know nobody Yo, cares. You, nobody wouldn't even be scared if you But uh, another there, trip like around security. the sun. Oh, step on my shit. Let me see. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you step on everybody else. The pre-chorus is coming up. This nigga is a fucking <laughs> narcissist. Yo, step, on yeah, yeah, yeah. step on my shit real quick. Yeah, 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 you already ain't go to Baskin Robbins for me. <laughs> Same went from Carvel to Baskin yeah, Robbins. But he got the Baskin Robbins shirt on. <laughs> Oh, shit. It's terrible, bro. Who dressed you today? <laughs> but seriously. What? I was going to clown you earlier, but I thought that was like your niece that had got hit by a car that you was trying to memorialize. <laughs> memorialize. <laughs> but yes. Memorialize. Why would you say that? <laughs> memorialize. <laughs> memorialize. <laughs> That's what I thought he was trying to do. They didn't like, you can't clown him if you're doing that. Nah, you I can't. thought he was doing the Melissa shit. Oh, what the fuck is that? Well, when I was four years old, <laughs> my cat got ran over by a truck a and I was traumatized forever. <laughs> it's really triggering when someone <laughs> when lands on me. So <laughs> don't fuck it. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this podcast as much as we enjoyed delivering it to you. We got about four months left of this iteration before changes are made again. Don't take it for granted like you did before, yo. Do right by us. <laughs> Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Y'all stop trying to come up here and shoot at Mel, too. I'm starting to get hip to y'all niggas, too. We get a lot of phone calls for guests. Uh, yeah. A lot of phone calls for oh, guests. No. And niggas, you stop shooting know. back. A little Miss Friendly. You stop being friendly. We niggas up here. We yeah, run this nigga. shit like niggas. Don't Got come it. up here and be friendly we need and invited. We 2008 mail, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Don't treat come. everybody like Buffy. No, yeah, I'm sorry. yeah, oh, yeah, shit. yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. Treat them like Buffy. Treat them like Buffy. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> treat them like Buffy. Don't go spraying pan for everybody. <laughs> spraying pan. Look, okay. shit shining. <laughs> you can't say that. No, you ain't gonna get enough. <laughs> they gonna teach you again. You ain't learn. You I ain't clad this time. Year. I ain't clad. You can tell when a nigga have a good year. No, nigga did learn. No, I learned. It's the other SPF. If these cameras is rolling, <laughs> we just shucking the job. We just shoot some jokes. All right, you can tell when a nigga get money. He just do whatever he want. Go ahead. Uh, oh, you can tell when a nigga got the <laughs> learned the lesson. Yeah, no, you can tell That's when a nigga learned his lesson. Atlanta told me I need to get more money. That's what mm, Atlanta told me. Mm. I ain't gonna lie. I need to get more money. Or get yeah. the same amount of money, but move to Atlanta. Yeah, or so we'll just get nah, out of New more York. <laughs> nah, them niggas is playing. We need more money. They playing. Too many billionaires just walking around with their anonymity, enjoying life. <laughs> mm. Damn, Stevie. <laughs> <laughs> Keep us in your prayers. La, 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 la. I am in Turks, shaking my ass. Y'all hold it down. Peace be unto all. Help. Wealth, love, prosperity to everyone. Hold it down. We'll be back when? On like the 8th, the 9th? Some shit. Some, some shit like that. Next week sometime. Mm -hmm. Yeah, next week. Next week, Saturday. Ne yeah. Long time. God damn. Mm -hmm. Hey. Nice little, nice little break. You know what I mean? Yo, sign up to the Patreon to see what the fuck niggas is up to. Prepare yourself. Because <laughs> when Friday When you comes, watch it, just remember it's old. It's, it's old. It's old shit. It's old. It's old. We pieced it up. We it's all old. friends. Oh, but man. when you see Commando Sunroof here go crazy, <laughs> you know why. When he come in and fire it all up, he already told us. That he's he spilling the business. Said, he said, that's my man. He's spilling the business. He let everybody know. He let know. everybody I'm know. He called, it. I'm on all you he niggas' He called a ass. group meeting in front of everybody. Yeah, even, nah. even Paul. Yo, yo, Paul, don't go nowhere. Come here. Come here. Paul, don't go nowhere. I'm telling all y'all. Nah, he told us. Say something. I'm like, I'm on all y'all ass. We love y'all, man. And don't take nothing out either. Don't, yeah, yep. nah. He said that. He said that. That was to me. Y'all hold it down, man. I'm going. My girl land soon. What a night, man. New episode of uh, Special Ops is out. Oh, I'll watch that. Oh, shit. I get to, go, get to go take a shower, wash my ass, be grateful for some things. I'll watch that one. I definitely yeah. broke like a bone in my wrist. And I haven't been telling anybody. So in Atlanta, I averaged 400 daps a day, and they was mm. on. That shit was. They broke it some more. You can't tell a man, yo, I can't, yeah. I can't dap. No, you can't. Or you can't just keep. You can't just. You gotta. And niggas be happy to see you. Say, bow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, play that, yo. Kobe, I gotta go to Kobe I'm, back. You know what I mean? Nah, I gotta go to the doctor, yo. They broke my shit. My old <laughs> hand was falling off in invest vest. <laughs> <laughs> so my, what's up, Joe? <laughs> <laughs> nah, stupid ass wrist, man. Forty three is fucking me up, from headaches to <laughs> broken bones. I'm out of here. Hit the chorus on them. Hey, man. They won't even sing to me. Pieces of shit. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> I know what all y'all shit is up. De- December, let's go. December, right? No, I think ice shit is in spring, I think. When is shit up? I got to look at ice shit. Ice shit, July. Yeah, I got him. I got him. He down. He down with me. I'm the only one out here early. July, December, May, whenever he want. <laughs> I'm not May. Uh-oh. Oh, no, not May. Hold on. June. Oh, yeah, you what month is this? You just signed uh, after the suspension. <laughs> how she how she finagle that one? <laughs> this, hell, this nigga's tough. Yo, Nair. <laughs> Yo, all right, man. Y'all be cool. You can't be cool. No, no, no. no, no, no. We can see you want to get on vacation. No. Nope. You fucking asshole. Why you want? No, nope. don't, don't say it, you idiot. I'm not saying nothing. My Stop. grandfather used to use Nair. Yeah. <laughs> Look, get your man. And I used it before right? too. Stink get in the bathroom. Get him. Get him. I stunk the bathroom. Why you just tell her go to the wax place? Yo. Would you fucking asshole? You keep going to Brooklyn and not <laughs> <laughs> Brooklyn shop out there. Don't move it up. Hey, they chopping everything but the right shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> I almost came in and shit on them. <laughs> No, you can't. No, you can't I wouldn't. Do that. You can't, I wouldn't. yo. That's why I didn't. Please. Because of, I, which one though? Not on for the no, the forty seven. No, 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 we man. need. We need that. You can't. Yeah, no. Even I, if it's bad, but, you can't. I never had a bad experience at, 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 at Chop House. When that nigga <laughs> spilled the drink all over my crotch, <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't the best time. But I still ain't coming in and saying. It's a fact. You ain't saying nothing. I found out. I ain't saying a word. Shout out to the niggas. And Don Poole was at in Best Fest. All these rich niggas were at Best Fest. That's what I don't get about y'all that, that be calling the EYL niggas scammers. I'll put this at the end where people might not hear it. <laughs> <laughs> y'all niggas that be calling them scammers, like, that was really the wealthiest black man in the country up there. It was really him. <laughs> it wasn't like a, a, a hologram. No, they had. That was really and Steve Harvey. That was really the. Robert Smith. Smith. That was, Robert that's Smith. really them. Don mm-hmm. Peoples. They had them. That's them for they real. They had the black thems up. Yep. Puff, you these ish. the people that they ish the people that they showing you they can't scam you with these these are real people. No, that's all I'm saying. No, and really, a lot of us don't even know some of those people exist. We don't. They got so to they walk around. Bringing, they are bringing people that you may have not not known existed to you, and they are black. So now you get some level of inspiration that I can achieve that too. Mm. These is niggas that you wouldn't know. Don Peoples existed if it wasn't for EYL. Now, if they start scamming in the future, I'm not going to do nothing. We talking about the debt. <laughs> Don't try to pull our shit back up <laughs> like the Caesar shit. <laughs> hey, yeah, big dogs. <laughs> Yo, y'all said I said Caesar. Like... We could shit on Caesar, no? Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, you can do whatever you want. I'm just saying. Listen, man, next year in Best Fest. Book Why money. you said we can shit on Caesar? Hold on, hold on. Are you talking about the shit you, the shit you took out? No. Oh, all right. I'm just saying, they're not connected, right? I'm going to keep shit on Caesar. They're not connected. Yeah, I'm going to keep shit on him. So and nice. you should too. Man yeah. up. Be a man. Keep he ain't going to you. He ain't going to stop you in the street. He going somewhere. He in Puerto Rico, nigga. You can talk. Be a man. <laughs> as long as I'm not doing my man, I'm good. <laughs> Yo, Rashad, Troy with your f- fucking EYL pajamas. Pajama head ass niggas. I'm going to get at you niggas soon, <laughs> but book, book my nigga ish to speak on that stage next year. Facts. Fuck is wrong with y'all niggas, man. I'm calling y'all next part. That's how we start the next part. <laughs> It's take us home, man. I got no music, no soundboard. Button. This nigga's a fool, yo. No Joe Button.